What is up, gamers? Welcome to Dig Cheese 2. Are we started? Are we live? Are we live? We are still D- live. Don't. Adam. I had a whole intro plan. Sorry. Anyway, this is Nick, Josh, we've got Dean and Caleb. Yeah? Yeah, it's towards your right there. <laughs> Um, like flight attendants, <laughs> I can just look to your right. This is going to be a very hyped set. Caleb Nunn's been playing uh, the post night <laughs> Caleb in a, in a match. Oh, uh, really? A couple years ago. Oh. So Gene's out for revenge. Gene's <laughs> coming for blood. Who's, um, wearing the, who's wearing the king tag? Can you hear me? It's all yeah, there's not a whole lot of uh, you in my ear. Yeah. Wish I had more story in my ear. I can tell viewers can relate. <laughs> Amen, brother. Um, Caleb, you've been playing for a while. A real grinder. Uh, a real grinder? Yeah. yeah. yeah Dingo and Green Trap is really weird. I'm, I don't really feel comfortable with it. But he does, but there's no stock lead here. Oh, that's a backy. Easy edge guard. Oh, okay. These guys play very differently, I would say. Dean really likes his, like, uh, jumpy, back airy. Yeah, Dean's definitely really airborne. Really not a pro player. I'm eating this microphone. Is this better? Here's the mic. Here's the mic. Here's the mic. This is my ears? Okay. So is this is this louder for you? No, it's quieter. Yeah. That's louder. good? That's good. That's good, man. That's perfect. I feel like I'm in the game now. I feel yeah, I feel like I'm here. Oh I can hear you so well. And you sound oh nice. Oh my. <laughs> oh my. Oh you gotta hit that knee. Oh, that's right, a good so what do you, what do you reckon about this matchup? This matchup so dumb. Why why is that? Just uh Nairs, right? And then grab. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much. I mean, yeah. it's really hard to stomp Falcon because he's so quick, you know? He's the fast one. Yeah. The fastest, some would say. Um, yeah. Yeah, that's a good gentleman. A bit hard to do in NTSC. Yeah, I think Falcon's fastness. Uh, like, when Brawl came out, you know how Sonic was the fastest, but he was so clearly, like, slow in many regards. Yeah. I feel like Falcon's the same. Like, he's obviously slower than Fox in all of his moves. Yeah. But, um,. He'd go fast with the run. Yeah, he run very fast. But the thing is that, that like just the running makes it really hard to like go for like stomp reads. It, wow, that was a really good stop. I think it's just one of those matchups where like the retreating aerial having high priority really yeah. uh, is important because both of them are gonna do nares and uh, usually the one that's retreating is gonna win. Yeah, there's not really much of an answer to um other than like a retreating back air, as we've just said, how the good retreating is. Like a retreating bear is going to be really good against Falcon. Oh. Just stops his nair. Caleb retreating getting reads reads and missing. Oh, oh that, that fucking tech was insane. It's really hard to tech me. There's so much head lag. And you yeah. Can't actually tech and that was so lag. close too. He might have buffered it just beforehand. Oh my god, is this going to be a clutch box? Can you imagine Caleb doing this? Caleb actually kind of shows up against the Desaders because I feel like a lot of SA players have learned how to beat him. But he does have a few tricks. Dean kind of choking this. Yeah, that's it. Oh, let's go, Caleb. Caleb, the Dean king of melee. Yeah, that's right. And Dean, the dunce, currently. Let's see if he can bring that's it back. That's my friend, man. I don't <laughs> none of that. Yeah. Well, Caleb's my friend. Speaking of clutch box, Nick trying to get me to ask for the clutch box at the local KFC. <laughs> it was very custom. Yeah. Wasn't this like that McDonald's, like go up to McDonald's and ask for the Fortnite burger? The look on their faces <laughs> the, would be Yeah, the Rick and Morty burger. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. And Dean with the color switch. Yeah. Same yeah. tag. And maybe, see, I was saying before, green. I don't really feel like sneak color. Pink, though? You really just gotta put the fucking knee into him there. I feel like Dean plays like a green falcon now. No. There's not many green falcons out there, so it's kind of hard to... Got the Silent Spectre aerial oh, yeah. drift thing happening. All the mega aerial drift. Oh, oh my! How did you get Very that? daring. That was insane. Oh dear, Dean's got the bears coming out now. Yeah, that's such a classic uh, Dean aerial actually. Like, back fully hit. double jumping up and then coming down with, with the a knee back, with yeah. like drift. Yeah. Is these side bees aren't really working for him. He got like one earlier, that's pretty much it. He's not really dashing, he's kind of getting stuck a lot. Like, he'll like land with an aerial and press button. Like, not like land, dash towards him, like cause a mix up. It's usually just retreating. Yeah. I think that's probably one of his bigger problems, as we can see here. There's like no mix up. It's just like always either run away or like hold ground. I feel that. Ooh. Um, oh, worth noting that this is Brown Robin Bulls, so if you're a big Dean fan, it <laughs> may not matter. <laughs> well. <laughs> Oh, well, wow, it's no a spectacle. Job. We've got like 40 hours of high octane melee this weekend. 
<laughs> Thanks to a very big and generous schedule. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Bro. Oh my god. <laughs> that guy's actually such a great representative for this game. There's a, a popular <laughs> clip Nick, Nick just keeps spamming in the house. Like, wow, he took that stock. That's a pretty tight match here. But um, it's Bro going like, really big, generous, neutral game here. <laughs> it's like, it's, what does that actually mean? Yeah. I want the people at home to think about that. What the what the fuck is a big, generous, neutral game? Yeah, and how, how can you better play one? Because it was really working out for the, the Fox in question at the time. Yeah. I want a big, generous, neutral game. Yeah, my, other, my neutral game is very small, kind of very elite. selfish. Yeah, exactly. I really want to be looking out for the other guy while I'm playing. Oh, a lot of wow. weak knees here. you got like four weak knees in a row. Yeah. It's kind of like fishing for knee and eventually getting it. We've seen Caleb clutches though, but Dean really not want to really shit the bed here. As, I, as seen. <laughs> yeah, I mean, Dean did kind of uh, throw away his second to last stuff last time. Don't worry about that one, man. Don't, don't bloody worry about it, man. <laughs> and where do you think we're going to go? If you were Caleb... I think Dean would ban FD. Yeah. If I was Caleb, I'd go to a little baby stage. You reckon? Yeah, yeah. Dean's playing really retreaty. Ooh. Big tech clock there. Oh man, these guys are scared. Being the first match on stream is actually terrible. Yeah, agreed. You know, warmed up. These guys actually warmed up with each other. Like, they yeah. were playing friendos against each other. Oh, you, gotta so, you gotta get that. So Dean will be worried, because I, I think I saw Dean winning most of the friendlies. He'll be like... Oh, wow. Dean wears glasses. Oh, no, they're probably um, the blue light glasses. They're probably purely for aesthetic purposes. I wouldn't put a pass in. Oh, you gotta... Yeah, Spud would kill there. Spud, renowned for his clutch on SA Nick at 220%. <laughs> Among other things. <laughs> nah, that's pretty much it. Ooh. Oh. He's flopped. They're kind of just like getting really antsy and that they don't get the initial edge guard. They won't do a cover up. Caleb's instant up airs are pretty good, I gotta say. Yeah. Like he's hitting ground in time, which. Oh, looks a little aesthetic there with that little movement trick there. Dean just can't help it sometimes. <laughs> sometimes he just comes out to play. Yeah. And we love to see it. Absolutely love seeing it. Oh, oh, big jab grab. You can't not crouch that, you know? He like whiffed a grab and he netted him from like a meter away. Yeah. After. And he didn't crouch. You gotta crouch. Yeah. Crouch cancelling is like honestly a secret society for playing true melee. Yeah. Like if you're not crouch cancelling, it's just like you're like on the setup, but are you really gaming, you know? Ooh, oh my. See, Dean's like ability to just like make this guy want to constantly run at him. He's so frustrating to hit when he's playing well. He's I, just like spamming the bears, doing the nares, and it's just like Falcon when he's doing that is so frustrating. You can't call him lame though, otherwise he starts crying. But <laughs> yeah, yeah, I found that the first time I played Dean's tournament, I was like, well, I know why I'm getting hit. It's because I'm trying to contest him in the air. Yeah. But I also have a sword, so I feel like I should be able to. <laughs> yeah. It's really annoying as Fox. It's just like your, your hitbox is just oh, oh, oh. There's a lot there. The hardest of reads. It's it's early. We usually hit that if any Americans are watching, I swear. Please. Yeah, we're pretty good. Oh. Oh wow, he died first. And Caleb with a strong show. Caleb's <laughs> but Dean able to take it 2-1 in the end. And we needed that. The Victorians needed that. Caelan's just smiling and nodding. And pointing. <laughs> yeah, Caelan relieved. I wonder what we've got up next. I'm excited for the day. Ooh, do you know what's on today? Deca Nangs in round in pools. Dope. Yeah, it's gonna be sick. There's Nick Scraddles. There's Nick Zai. A couple of foxes up to the chopping block here. It's not not for a while though. We yeah, get to no see fun. Miles play pools as well. Yeah, that's good. It's always a pleasure seeing Miles play. <laughs> I wish I, I the thing I don't like about round robin pools is like there's not the high stakes choke factor, you know? There's not yeah. like uh This is it, this is Genesis. This is it, like, <laughs> Caleb about to make a big upset, you know. Yeah. Dean to be sent to losers. Howdy. Miles oh, for the Miles. shirt swap. <laughs> really hated the plastic get out and game shirt. Is that a legacy shirt? No, it's a, no, it's a Miles Ale has one. That's a great shirt. Pretty good logo. Miles, good at branding. <laughs> no, that's, um, um, you know, GG Easy Bar's very own Lockie. That's his wife's um, design. Very really own cool. Lockie. Is this Miles versus Miles versus Brad? That's insane. <laughs> Starting off with a Brad looking, a, Brad looking a little tense here. Bang. Listening to some music. Hopefully it's Kanye. I feel like Brad. Every time I've seen him, he's looked tense. He's always like shivering a little bit, twitching a little bit, muscles old hands. He hasn't said hi to me today. 
Yeah, he's he usually... actually flatly refused to greet you before. I saw that. Yeah. He's just he's, trying to get in the zone. He's feeling the pressure. He's trying to overtake Stock My Son as the preeminent As the Hokage, talent. if you will. Yeah, the Hokage. The Hokage. <laughs> the Hokage gets you every time. He will be the Hokey Pokey, exactly. <laughs> whether you want it or not. Shout out to Sock My Son, by the way. First or fourth, really. <laughs> Smoking some wild shit that I would love to hit. <laughs> but yeah, we've got the uh, the uh, protagonist, Brack, mm. Brad, against uh, Miles. <laughs> the uh, the guy with, with a lot of heart. <laughs> a lot of heart. A lot of sweat Miles. and toil. Ma to quote Miles on the setup with Spud, Don't be a lot of heart, but not as much skill as the guy next to him. That was my skill, but a lot of heart. It's just leaking heart. On this setup, though, I think both got a lot of heart, both got a lot of skill. Don B the favorite, Brad the up and comer. Don B is definitely the favorite. And Brad fresh off a victory against Sock My Son at Sunny Side Up. You gotta be riding the coattails of that. He'll be thinking he's got a shot, he'll be thinking he knows the matchup well. We saw in Dreamlet. And we might be in They're good to go. For some bloody fireworks. <laughs> hey, it's my shadow. Look. Oh. <laughs> you can see behind Brad. Hold on. <laughs> I'm beating the shit out of Brad. Anyway, uh, Miles with the <laughs> lockdown. Miles and I play this matchup pretty much like every, every fucking day. It's so. Oh. That's oh. cool that we can see our shadows. That yeah. way, that everyone will know that we're not getting up to any funny business. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you gotta hit that tech chase, Miles. Miles knows that. Shakes his head in a little animosity. With a little animosity. Oh, that was a good one. That was actually just a shit spot to RP. Because that, that bear covered. Literally everything. He could have gone down, but yeah. Going straight down there's pretty scary though. Alright, Miles moving a bit. He's not quite getting the follow ups he needs, but he's getting some We appreciate the, the burp. Guess who's back? It's Green Donnie. Oh, yeah, is Brad that, gets cheese mine. Oh. Is he green only because of uh, Brad picking white? I don't think. I think Miles would be the first to pick white and then bark if he doesn't get it. Ooh, yeah. I don't like that choice though. Yeah, just have to like sit there and crouch or just like be ready to react. That's good up tilt. Weak there, up smash. Oh, he falls off by accident. Yeah, I think the green is actually so yeah. iconic. Oh, you have to hold. The green spot, sorry. So iconic for Miles. It I is. Think Miles is uh, turning over a new leaf in life where he's uh, very comfortable with himself, you know? Yeah. Oh, before that's... he was trying to change and become someone He's trying to go new. for the Mungo Slayer. <laughs> that would have been crazy, actually. The Mungo Slayer is so good. And Brad holds that. Brad's definitely been slain a few times, though, so he knows the tricks. Good roll, really. Oh, that's not going to kill. Very close though. With a little charge on it. Oh, bad landing. Miles is really good at catching these landings here. Miles is kind of owning him. Yeah. Good time off. The, <laughs> the super household really is just the hyperbolic time chamber, honestly. Yeah. I mean, Miles only got to the house last time. Oh, yeah. oh my god, that angle. I thought he was dead. Oh, okay, relax. Let's double up here. Oh, we got a terrible extended. Oh wow, he had his jump the whole time. Oh yeah, smash. Yeah. Uh, and Brad will be a little bit rattled, I reckon. Yeah. Wasn't really a close game. It was a bit of fucking. But the thing is, though, Brad, look at him thinking. He's just like, what would Joshy do? Miles, pressing start. Let me go next. Brad really regretting not greeting Sora earlier this morning. <laughs> Thinking he needs all the crowd support he can get. <laughs> and don't be looking confident. He's got a smile on his dial. Hopefully, probably uh, the same in the off. Hopefully his hubris doesn't get better on it. Oh, great patience there. He knew he wouldn't get that tech chase. Oh, this is that shine there. Oh, and, no, respect the no, no, I respect it. I respect nah. it. I respect it. It's it's because like the stakes are so low that I reckon it's lame though. It's not really yeah exactly the stakes are so low not just dropping it would be too lame. Brad's tilted though. You can tell. You gotta get a ledge for that. Yeah, look, he's not really looking at the game. He's sighing. Yeah. This is when you really yeah look he's trying to get that mentality back and that's all you can really ask for. Is his eyes closed? No. <laughs> uh, yeah, you can't have him stop twice there. You get one. Yeah, look, he's just swinging now. Miles is just like, just putting down the sick dog. Not a particularly strong strong for Brad. Hopefully he can pull it together. I mean, it's, it's round very robbing. lenient uh, tournament set up here. Oh, he tried to go for the angry Mungo Slayer. Yeah, this set's pretty much over. Unfortunate about double SD, but that's the, that's the pressure. 
I mean, he was kind of getting owned anyway. And uh, he lost his mentality after the first game. There I are like two ways you can respond after like getting three stuff game one. There's like, I'm playing bad, or there's like, I the thing is, together. The thing is, though, there's a lot of... There's a lot of law with Brad here. You know, he's very upset right now. You can see. He fist bumped him. Good. He didn't throw his controller. That's a plus. And he walked off the stage. He's probably going to go take a second. Just rehabilitate, you know. Go talk to the friend. Say, guys, I got a little fucked. You know, I kind of got my clock cleaned. But it happens, you know. When we get a great now. player. Legacy's own Don B. GG's. <laughs> Oh, we got Bailey PCG. This might actually be hype. Oh, really? Yeah. I don't actually have no idea how good Bailey is. Bailey's just a new Sora. <laughs> Christ. Look at him. Actually, he doesn't look like you there. He doesn't. He just looks really. <laughs> he looks, he looks kind of very skinny yeah. compared to how he looks in real life. Yeah. I think his face is very, like. It's like a tall, skinny, lanky man. Amen to that, brother. Good to see another in real life, he's like a... Uh, a Chad. A Chad, if you will. So don't, you know, don't trust everything you see on TV, kids. They're actually <laughs> better looking in real life. <laughs> <laughs> the camera actually takes away 10 pounds. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh, right, bit of a he's not moving very well. Um, sorry, Bailey, is it? Lord. Oh, yeah, that <laughs> now is just... <laughs> Bailey needs to stop moving. Missing fastballs. Oh, oh, he's actually choking. He needs to get. Yeah. It's the call on the power of the SA Nick Voodoo doll. Sorry. <laughs> oh, yeah, anything other than grab there would have been good. Yeah. I feel like this set's going to be really good to watch back though later on. It's just like, okay, what was I doing? It's like, well, I wasn't playing. Maybe I should do that next time. Yeah, that's still always a good start. Yeah, Alex will bleed you out too if you're not playing. Like, he's not going to finesse you. He's just going to play his own game. In saying that though, still really close game. Alex looks at us, the heavens, saying, why is Falco able to do that to me? And he's moving now. He's dash yeah. dancing, you know? He's not just doing jumps. Hmm. That was a good recovery. Steve do something there. Uh, no ledge dash there. Oh, I don't really know what's going on. Alex's not always the most composed player either, so like yeah. Bailey could inflict some mental damage here and uh, make some things happen. Bailey's shooting the gun a little bit. <laughs> yeah, that's the classic. Foxes who don't trust their tech chase, that is full hop. You can only cover one option, and for some reason the space you text in place. Yeah, sorry, uh, Bailey is Lord and Alex is PCG. I know yeah. mid-level players, by the way. It's not, it's, <laughs> it's whatever. Yeah, yeah, we're just a homie <laughs> scene, it's whatever. Yeah. Does Mango know your name, you know? It's like, think about that. Yeah. That's it. Told age roll up. Oh, get off tax good though. Yeah. Good stuff. Solid. Clean. He's just like like even when he drops from the respawn platform, there's like no fastball. Like there's a lot of practice that needs to be done here. Shine. Yeah. That was <laughs> cool. That's gonna kill, that's crazy. Oh, oh no, barely. Even like he just looks really rigid right now. Yeah, I don't know what it is. I feel like he's usually cleaner than this. Maybe I've just been playing with Spud mm. in the last two days, and uh, You've everything just looks terrible now. <laughs> that was an off smash. Yep. Oh, what's he, what's he going up there? He like literally ran into the center stage, did a red in there, full hop to the top platform with an up air, and then F smash on the top platform. It's like it's just tournament nerves. You can't. Man. You can't win games like that, you know? Yeah. You have to like at least be able to Unless you're Jordy, your you can laser F smash. Like you can either simplify your ideas so that they're easy to execute, or yeah. you've got to practice. Yeah, no, that's definitely key. I think um, Drug Fox actually has a good little um, lesson on that one when he's talking to, I think it's Billy Bo Peep, he's just like, you're trying to do options you don't have the speed for yet. It's like in too rapid of a succession. And it's like, you don't really need it to win round one push, you know? Yeah. You don't really need to be moving like Mango. You can just slow it down and just have better ideas and execute them well. Really strong stop for Bailey there, though. That was. pretty much the whole stop, to be honest. Yeah. I think you might have just been trolling the first game. <laughs> He's just playing like with the space a lot better now. Maybe he felt a little suffocated. Oh, yeah, that's a good try. That's it. I wonder how much SDI he would have needed to go tech there. He can just hold down most of the time, but he was airborne. 
No, I mean uh, off the shine, off stage. You know how you got sent towards the stage? Oh, yeah. Like if you SDI'd up and like did some crazy trajectory DI. It depends which part of the shine hits you too. Yeah. Which is so weird, isn't it just one hitbox? It is, it's just it's just how it looks relative to where you, your body is. Yeah. I've heard like people say the top of the shine like spikes better. Yeah. Yeah, no, it does sound cool shit. Oh, you gotta, you gotta hit those, that's Genesis. <laughs> so that's Genesis Core is actually gonna give Fess an anxiety attack. I swear to god. <laughs> like he misses like an F smash, I'm like, that's Genesis man, he just like instantly tenses up. <laughs> oh, no, oh, no AC bears, like, just near and nothing. I'm, I'm curious to see what he has to say after the set. He's a genius part looking relatively cleaner and faster. Getting his kills where I can and, like, cleaning out edge guards, that's all you really need to do. Mm. Well, it's still a close game. Um, the way dash is looking a little sloppy. It's just, like, uh, there's too much waiting going on in between, like, each decision and option, you know? I can't it's believe like that hit Alex, by the way. He just literally lasered and then ran it dead. And Ooh, just hit him. Damn. Oh. Don't be afraid of those recoveries, too. Don't be afraid to get to the ledge when you can. Mm. Look, I think... Yeah. We're kind of like harping on Bailey a lot here, but that's just because it's just a little bit more apparent, you know? Yeah, yeah. There's no bias here. Oh, that's it. Uh. How's he gonna get in here to get the final kill here again? Oh, weird kind of choice. Just dancing around but not really doing anything. Mm. He was. Ooh, I like that. That's cool. Wave dash back in, up tilt. Like cover ledge, yeah. You gotta cover ledge with the laser there. Alex is just playing really well out of shield. All these openings have just been from an L smash out of shield, a shine out of shield, something out of shield. And there's really no point to it. Oh, oh that, that was great. Was yeah. Especially, yeah, that was great. Is Bailey gonna clutch from that? That's. Yeah, that's a good that's confidence boost. But the thing is, though, like that's when you Falco at low percent against like a low percent Fox, sorry, it's actually really hard to get an opening with anything but a tear. Oh, and he's gotta hit your fast balls. Let this be known, this game was over off that dare. And that's just gonna be an edge guard. Oh, never mind. Oh. Oh, that's good. Yeah, that's like, yeah. This is tense. Yeah. Careful of a bear. Shine Eye Shield, there's nothing there. Yeah, a million openings here to win the game. Just a little bit more practice, just a little bit more better decisions, you know? And you'll get there. He's stuck so many times in this movement. Yeah, exactly. PCG capitalizing. Yeah, that was like. I don't think PCG played amazing. Like, he didn't play that clean. He wasn't that threatening. He did what he but had he to do. He just kind of waited around and Bailey eventually made movement mistakes. Yeah, eventually the guy's going to choke himself out, so. Bailey had a couple of chances, even while not executing well, to, like, finish off combos and make it more even. Yeah, it's And like a couple of really clutch calls as well, with that back air, especially. Yeah. To, like, get the edge guard. But, um. Yeah. I look, I want to see more from Bailey. He clearly has the confidence to do certain things. He just needs the execution behind it, you know? Missing fast falls, no shines out of shield. The lasers kind of just like running in and doing them. There's like a lot of things there, which is just like, look, I'm gonna rewatch this. I'm gonna see. I didn't like any of this, and these people are right. I'm gonna grind a little. Well, bit. maybe he'll be like, actually, Josh, I played What amazing. I was trying to do was this, and it would have worked. <laughs> that doesn't defeat the execution <laughs> purpose, though. <laughs> actually, Josh, I hate figurative. I'm Bailey. just trying to express myself through the game. Shut the fuck up, figurative <laughs> Bailey. This <laughs> is imaginary Bailey. He's an asshole. He does. <laughs> Just barking for no reason. Exactly. What are we going on next? We know what's best for you, Imaginary Bailey. Look at Dom Hines right now. Absolutely posted up. Do we have crowd cam? I really Is regret not having That's crowd cam for Sleeping Musket. Is that Campbell versus Geordie here? <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh, that <laughs> hype. Geordie, hot favorite. Campbell. Campbell uh, actually can do it too. I've seen him do it. Once. <laughs> and I love the Garfield shirt a lot. Of course, dude. That's Campbell good. always wears that shirt. I actually don't know if he owns another shirt. Dude, Jordy's aesthetic is so good right now. Yeah. He's got a haircut. He's my shirt. so cool. <laughs> Cube. I don't like pulling the screen up. We all know what the stages are. You know what I mean? It's like I ban Yoshi's and Fountain. It's like, oh, what else is there? It's like, come on. Oh, you, you don't like the players doing it? Maybe they have to for stream purposes? No. No. No, yeah, a guy definitely giving a big no. Because it is illustrative, you know? For the 
popular. It is, but like... Who wants to know the strength process? And where do we end up? Is it Yoshi's? Yeah. Yeah, Yo this is really... Geordie always picks this stage. I don't know how I feel about it. But Geordie likes it, and he actually performs really well here most of the time. He does like a hitbox. Oh, that was great, Shiner Shield. These are... Yeah. We'll see a different breed of factor here from Bailey. Oh, that's a that's the Sora loses the SA Nick grab. Yep. Just goes through him. <laughs> it's like when Fox gets so, Roy zoned, it's like It's like sorry man. Really Ooh, that happening. was an insane edge guard. Like when Mask gets Roy zoned, you're like, well, at least I can reach halfway across the stage yeah. most of the time and grab. I guess it makes sense that I have one spot that I can't grab you from. Yeah. But Fox doesn't really feel that fair. Yeah, it's just like okay. <laughs> When like you shine out a shield on the side and on the lip, and because you did a perfect shine out a shield, no hitbox comes out. It's like all right. <laughs> How dumb is that? So uh, it's gonna cover this. Yeah. Oh, yeah, nice. And Can these guys are like closure. old school best friends, right? Yeah, these guys have known each other before melee. Yeah. So there's a bit of a rivalry here. Jordy, that up tilt was amazing. Yeah, good not to shield drop there. Jordy was actually actively reading it. Wow, that's a that dead is destroyed. Oh, that recovery is really bad. I think he was like, wow, Geordi's like killing himself. I'm just going to go down and get him. And yeah. then Geordi did like some weird bait maneuver where he jumped really out of the down air. Yeah, no, it, it did look pretty weird, but like, you got to have like game sense to know, like, all right, well, he can still live this. I don't like Geordi going for grounded shines there. He should have gone for like an earlier airborne shine and wave landed on top platform and got the punish. Yeah, Falco just being on. Oh, wow, that. This placement of aerials right now is insane. You need to be really cognizant of when Fox and DI to the top platform, because that really makes him comp- oh, and he keeps going for the sail shine as well. I don't like. <laughs> what a read. <laughs> oh my god, what a scary trip. Campbell got scared there, he thought he'd die. Good tech chase. Oh, good up air. Or oh, I should have seen another up air there, but- Oh my god, Campbell's no, not no. really playing his game. You got a shield drop faster on that one, Campbell. That Ooh. was such a great wavelength back Ooh, here, into that side beat, but lives. Shakes out of the... Oh, how does that shine hit? How does that up air hit? Wow, that was insane, DI. Go straight there. Jordy trying to swag. This might be the end of him, though. Oh. And then we got a last look situation I see Jordy loses. <laughs> we all have, man. Oh, you gotta... You know, if you're running shine... Oh, you get him in the corner. Bad yeah, choice. Could've everything. Yes. <laughs> That's Genesis. Could've been Genesis. Realistically. <laughs> And Campbell thinking, where can I take this man? Give me a better shot at winning. You should go back to Yoshi's, I reckon. I feel like Geordi's kind of hard to open up on Dreamland. Agree. Because he's just going to play his game like this, yeah. Because you spend like 80% of the match chasing him for like shooting retreating lasers, and then when you try to like chase him again, he's just got a dare in your face, and it's just like, oh fuck, there it is. Oh, yeah. I feel like Geordi's combo game could benefit from some time in Uncle Punch. Or like 20XX. Yeah. Like he goes for a lot of extensions that don't lead it. Like that one? I don't like that. Yeah. He could have down aired or naired or something. Yeah, the double laser here? Yeah, that's just a dunk here. Yeah. Luckily his neutral game is pretty smart and he's like pretty good on the edge guards, so. Yeah. Oh wow, that was an edge. Mm, like up tilt something, like, you know, get him like higher. Like yeah. extend for a bit more percent. Like doing that now, it's like, well, they held away, now like they're just on the other side of the stage. Oh, yeah. I think I read it. Yeah. Oh, you got up tilt. Ooh. Absolutely kicks him. Are you gonna say it? <laughs> you gonna drop the kicks on Kongs right now, Nick? Oh, kicks. <laughs> <laughs> That was actually very king's <laughs> ass. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Yeah, look, this is over. <laughs> the thing is, though, Campbell's gonna need, like, with his punish game, he's gonna need, like, 20 openings to win this game. Yeah. Or a game. Yeah, it's hard with. Oh, my, there it is. There it is. <laughs> Yeah, Foxes just don't really have it. Like, even like less skilled Falcos, you can still kind of rely on them to get a combo. Yeah. But Fox, it's, it's hard. It is hard. Like, really bad players would complain like about Fox just being able to gimp you all the time, rah rah, but it's just like, his genuine punish game is really difficult. It's just like, why, why play honest when you can the cheese? If Campbell wins this... <laughs> yeah, long way to go from here then. I'll eat my big cheese, stubby holder. Good up tilt. Oh. oh, you got to Yeah. Missed the L cancel, misses the bear there. 
Yeah, Campbell, one of those players that has kind of a reputation as, like, technical, I guess. Yeah. But, like, there's a difference between technical and, like, consistently executing. Yeah. Oh, that's a trick. No, there really is, you know. Like, Armada would be considered technical, but has, oh, wow, like, that's the kill. best tech skill in Melee ever. Yeah, easily. Just the cleanness on him is disgusting. Jordy wraps it up. Keeps it simple. Jordy, one of those players who, like, not that technical, not that fast, yeah. but he really has simplified his game plan so that he's always able to execute the things that he wants. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, there's, like, yeah, a good simplified game plan, especially, in, like, like I said before, in, like, this level of pools. And here's the match, by the way, that everyone's waiting for. Oh, we got Real Falcon? This is risky from Dave. I don't know if this is real. I this is, is real. Oh, shit. I we all know love the, the famous clip. Characters. Oh, okay, hold on. We just gotta. <laughs> that yeah. was good paper there. Jack out reads him as he is known for. Yeah, no, that's a Dave. <laughs> Winning rock, paper, scissors. Yeah. No, Dave, uh, for those who don't know about the legendary Nang's, Nang's Deckard set, there was a dunk to end all dunks. Oh, yeah. Oh, I remember yeah, that the now. tech wall jump dunk. That last hit, last stock, game five. That just fucking ended him. What is that actually? I was, it was actually game four, and then at that point, um, because Ruben was up two one, and if he misses that, it's over for him, and he hits it. And they're going to game five. Ruben's mentality was just. Wait, no, I think Ruben won that set. <laughs> no, was... that, that was the winning thing, right? It no, was like no, it wasn't. It ago. wasn't. Ruben won the set anyway. That makes sense. Yeah, no, it was a bam. Uh... I'm fairly sure Dave. Won. It was bam 2018. Did Dave win? Yeah. It wasn't last game though. It was definitely. I think four. it was last game. It wasn't. I remember they played again. And, oh, that's a bit of a choke there. That's key. Sam's just going to live for ages, even against Falcon. Anyway, the legend of that down air lives on, even, <laughs> even though none of us remember the specifics. Yeah. It was less sick. Yeah. Oh, wow. Nair beats Missile. Okay. That's the thing about Melee. Sometimes the mythology is like worth more than the fact. Yeah. And Dave is really that kind of player. He's cultivated a myth around him, you know? Yeah. And when you look at his gameplay objectively, sometimes it's like, well, it's not really executing the most optimal thing. But there's and, uh, a lot of magic behind it. The magic is... <laughs> you can really feel the dominance through the screen when you play him sometimes. Yeah. I wouldn't call him aggressive, I wouldn't call him defensive. I just call him magical. <laughs> Ooh, is that it? Oh, yeah, we would hate for that not to kill. He's just doing shit. Uh, you can't be just whipping moves like that. Like, either do an edge guard or get out of there. Yeah. yeah. Good spacing. Oh my god, through the missiles. That was a good forward air. Yeah. Forward air is such a weird move. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. Good air dodge. You know when uh, there used to be like matchup guides on Smash Bros and they'd like rate every move out of five? Yeah. Yeah. I feel like forward air is one of those moves that would always get like a, a two. Yeah, but it's like, insane. Don't use this. Kind of like Fox's down tilt was always like, yeah, this move is not as good as the other moves. Yeah. And now it's just like the most busted move ever. <laughs> it's boomer opinions, man. Oh, you gotta hit that. Oh, down smash. It's so scary. Is he gonna die? Yeah, oh. don't get hit by that, Ruben. He, like, you had to know that the only thing he could hit you with was that back air. Yeah. So. Ooh, that run-up was cool, though. Dave's really, gonna grab more, I reckon. I don't know who I'm going for here. I feel like, uh... Well, I'm unbiased, obviously. But as a South Australian, I gotta go for Ruben. But I'm, like, the oldest Dave fan. In the book? Not in the book. But, uh... I've been, I've been a fan since I first started Australia Melee. <laughs> Dave just has a magic to him. He definitely... <laughs> Dave definitely told me to fuck off the first time I ever met him, oh and that's it. Wow. It's so hard to capitalize into me against Samus. Yeah, it really is. Like, you have to stomp at such a specific percent. Yeah. And to kill on top plat... Like, it's everything. I actually don't think the Falcon's a bad choice at all. I think Ruben might play Fox or something after this game if he loses. Oh, that's bad. Yeah, that's all bad, yeah. Nah, uh, Ruben won't play Fox. Yeah. What's with the blue wristbands? Um, yeah, good question. It's quite a two. It's probably like a TO thing. No, Geordie's got one. Probably like an important, well-liked person thing. Oh. Uh, yeah, me neither, man. Don't worry. 
Oh, and the moth comes out, the sword guy. It's good to see the moth, man. Ruben with a lot of experience in this matchup. Uh, we've played many times himself and me. It's so yeah. scary when the Samus just doesn't do anything and you're above him as moth. It's like, press a button, <laughs> let me back. Yeah. Good recovery. Ooh, right in the face. Yeah, Ruben, one of those players that's always scary for me as a moth man uh, to play against. So, Dave, I, I don't know. You gotta be really clean, and it's not really what Dave's known for, but he can make some <gasps> magic happen. Wow, the damage is just right. He just Adizzy. killed him. He just killed him. See that? Oh my god, it's just magic, man. <laughs> yeah, really great, like old school oh, comboing right. style as well, using the air. Yeah. Harkens back to the uh, the old Ken Ruben days. Just holding in. If you're gonna play a fold, floaty, at least hold out, man. It doesn't matter for our spaces, but at least let us see what it's like. And you cannot side beat Samus at any percent ever. Like, they're gonna crouch at 150%, so don't do it. Ever. Oh, that couldn't have been a dunk, I think. Spud would have hit it there. He would have found a way. Mm. Spud do be finding ways to dunk. <laughs> I'd be dunking. Um, Everyone. But it's gonna be a W. With clanking, I'm pretty sure like clanks like depending on how strong the move is that you're throwing out or how like laggy it initially is, it like affects the yeah. lag behind the clank. That's true, right? That's so why Shine is just like no lag. Yeah. You clank with it. It might also be because you're invisible, but like jabs like clanking will be like a lot faster than like Mars swinging with an F smash or something. That's true, I'm pretty sure it's the same best. Yeah. And like maybe animation best. Ooh, that was good. This is scary against Samus. Coming down here, she's at 123. Oh my well, yeah. that, that you, gotta, was, you can't uh, really expect Samus to roll there. Wow, no He shot. literally killed him with dominance. <laughs> yeah, with dominance. That was insane. Deckard, just in his brain, stole his uh, soul with that standstill. And now he's going to win. Look at this. <gasps> I wish you could dunk that. Oh, you're going to hit this. Oh. Yeah, he's just playing a lot more passive now. Holding the center, holding the ground. Dave knows that Ruben's like, I'm being dominated now. And he's like, get an antsy. He's like, look at this stupid guy standing still doing nothing. I'm just going to do melee tech skill things and win. But you can't do that sometimes. Oh, a scary spot for both players there. He's going to grapple? Yeah. Oh! oh. I, I like never know when they're going to miss the switch. Ruben's part. grabs are so good. Yep. When he's in your head with the grabs, it's so annoying. Good up air. You can kill him here. Oh. What a weird hitbox I'm up to there. I think Ruben thought Ooh, that Dave wow, was going to jump up and up there. So yeah. he went for a really early down air, but both just whiffed and it was a really weird scramble. Yeah. Dave goes for a grab there. I think he needs to come over there and it's going to be a huge open up. But as it is, we got even sucks. Yeah, he's definitely dead. Oh dear. <laughs> that was close. The, the J is charged. Oh my. Yeah, he's, he's going to get shot. Oh, what the fuck? He like slid off. Might hit behind his shield. Yeah. Oh, good yeah. read of double jump, no jump. Oh. That's a that's a Ruben habit of old. He loves the double jump out of pressure. Oh, he's got to up tilt that. Oh my god, this is just. Oh yeah, good up smash. Dave's looking strong. You hear the. Oh, good up air. Keep him in the air. Oh, keep him in the air. He's got his jump back now though. Oh my god, he yeah, wastes he it. So up tilt. Early. That's it. That's Holy a Ruben fuck, jump. That's hot. You gotta you gotta save your resources, Samus. <laughs> the magic's here, dude. <laughs> It's where it gets a bit tense. You don't want to be in a game three situation against the magical one. The be yeah, exactly. The mythical one. The myth. <laughs> yeah, these guys fighting for uh, one of only 24 spots in the first track. <laughs> so everything's on the line here. <laughs> oh, good read. Oh, good there. There's no yeah. jump. Yeah, Davis cottoned on to the fact that Ruben does Oh, could I smash anything? You got to smash that. Floor. Down tilts. Where are the down tilts? Where's anything? Oh my god, he <laughs> is just eating his ass on the train. <laughs> <laughs> the mythical one. Oh, <laughs> what the fuck? Just up here or something. Was yep. that kill? Oh. Some loose. Grab ledge. No. No. Just throw a detail out, bros. I wish he would do the right thing sometimes. Actually, I actually don't know if the detail was the right thing at all because at this point, this guy isn't gonna punish you for these ass smashes. He hasn't. He's he's scared. Just swing until he blacks out. 
Oh, the, the, the SA Nick, not a big fan of the mythical one. This balloon on the floor, kind of want to go grab it. I'm a huge fan of the mythical one, oh. but I just wish he would do the right option one time. You know what I mean? But then he wouldn't be the mythical one. That's true. <laughs> This is, this is probably the most scared I've ever seen him play in my life. Is he dead? What? Oh, he's psycho, that's why. David really does have that uh, fear factor. It's real, man. You know the show Fear Factor? You have to like, eat cockroaches? <laughs> yeah, it said you have to go into a glass cage with Decker. <laughs> yeah, David's like a writhing well, dunks you. glass cage of cockroaches. <laughs> <laughs> and Ruben can't handle the heat right now. <laughs> the cockroaches are just too spicy for him right now. Calling Dave a, a room full of cockroaches isn't really nice, but... And to continue on the thing... Oh, great comes into Nair again. I love his Nairs right now. This isn't really Deckard esque but maybe it's because we play spaces. Oh my god! Um, and yeah, to continue on that thing, yeah, now he's in Melee, him. who dares wins? Huh? It's another TV show. Who dares wins? Yeah. You remember that one? It's very old. Probably older than you. Um, yeah, I am quite young. Oh yeah, that was a crazy time. Oh, I had that off tip up. It's because he's gap attack. Wow, okay, this is a bit of a fucking punishment, this game. Ruben's really got to pull together, bring this one back. you got to hit that. Ruben oh. is clutch, though. He can get an edge guard and... Uh... you got to have confidence here. See, this is the position time after time. That side beat into air dodge. You've seen it four times now. Just like, oh, the dash is not up. The CC is not Yeah, the old, uh, surely he'll mix fair, it up fair. next time. Yeah. See, Dave's just going to keep playing this game with dominance, and he's going to wave dash off or something from there. Ooh, and he gets stuck there. Oh. That's pretty fucking scary. <laughs> oh, my shot's out. Dave's just... <laughs> That's so dumb. You're shooting him. Is that dodge? <laughs> oh my god, there's another side beam. Yeah, Ruben's winning this. Ooh. Oh. <gasps> Ruben's winning this, dude. <laughs> the magic Dave is trolling the one. a little too hard. <laughs> no. <laughs> Don't fuck. He's just jumping now. D Dave's playing scared, and you don't want to see that from the Yeah, Dave knows he's like outside as well. You know? Oh yeah, I know. He's he, he's been, he's been charged rent for staying in Ruben's head, and Ruben's just like, no thanks. No way, dash out of shield, no punch. Oh my god, if that hit, that would have been it. <laughs> oh, oh yeah. My god, yeah. I, I said he was gonna clutch it. Like, oh no. <gasps> he's gonna get down. This is scary. Don't get tippid. Don't land on. Oh, it's so scary to land on it. Yeah, I think this is so gonna fun. Be it. Gonna wait, oh yeah, my god! I knew he was gonna go for it. Dave oh, two, and that just and that's a, a three-stop comeback there. Wow, yeah. that was really well played. He really. He was just like, my head is my own. He's screaming <laughs> into the crowd. Get out of my head, Dave. Yeah. Yeah. Charles. Crazy comeback. You can see it happening though. You don't see that stuff in Mar Fox. That's the thing about old school Melee and Dave particularly, is that Melee back then was such a game of mental fortitude and you could see the moment that it like switched he really who just, was winning. Yeah, his brain evolved from a cocoon into a full fucking butterfly there. And now he's flying around the venue, uh, chirping. Yeah, exactly. Ruben really blossomed into a beautiful <laughs> little flower. Yeah. <laughs> God. From a disgusting little onion. <laughs> 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 that's, the, that's how nature works, right? <laughs> <laughs> Who's gaming now? And we've got Ella and Luma. I've never seen that guy. Yeah, Luma's probably going to win. Luma? Yeah. Who's Luma? Luma? Yeah. From Tasmania. Pretty okay melee player. Uh, who does Luma play? Jigglypuff, Fox, and Captain Falcon. Cool. And Ella plays Fox. Yes. I, I don't know how I feel about these Summit shirts. I don't like them. <laughs> They're grotesque. I kind of like it. It's all the Kill tag coming out. Yeah, Jigglypuff, yeah. Didn't the Kill, like, seem to exist? Yeah. yeah, I mean, they're still friends. But there's a lot of lore I just still will never know about. Yeah, I, think I feel like there's so much it. potential for very deep lore to develop in that situation. They are getting straight into it. There is a lot. Yeah, dude. After Nick and I stayed at the Kill House, just playing Klonoa 2. Ugh. What an awful game. I said it was awful, and they both, well, they all yelled at me. <laughs> it was a terrible game. <laughs> the hitboxes just don't exist. Wow, reverse pound there. Oh, and that's a death. You gotta fall with an up air here. Yep. Good, good, good. Oh. That could be it. Oh, you gotta know your timings there. You can like almost instant move against Puff. Yeah, just grab, uh, obviously, based Ooh. on the weight of the character you're throwing. Ella's not playing bad. Oh, grab that. 
I hate Foxes. Uh, you can't really bomb up smash against Pop, I reckon. Just use your grabs if they're going to play shield a lot. Ooh, that could be... Oh, I missed the jump there. This is a matchup you don't really see much in Australia. There's no Jigglypuffs at all. Yeah, rest in peace, uh, Milo, and um, I guess Billy's Puff. Yeah. Two legends of the game. Some of the best to ever do it. <laughs> and my Puff, obviously. Oh yeah, Nick Puff. Jesus. <laughs> Nick Puff was definitely the best Puff in Australia. Unless Spud plays Puff. <laughs> oh, up tilt, uh, F tilt instead of up tilt here. Yeah. Oh, just... Don't bomb smashes, because it's a 123. Yeah, this, this, this shouldn't happen. There were so many spots where you could have gone an opening there. You know what I mean? You could have been grab at 70. Now you have to play 123. It's just awful. I do know what I mean. Let's go back there. Oh. Ooh, you can go for forward air or something, I reckon. It's like fishing for up air like that. It's so low percentage. Playing percent. just the wrong moves in general. Like, what are these running shines? What are you going to get off it? You're going to tech chase path? Like, okay. Like, if you're not good enough to take chest puff, that's fine. But just play other moves. Yeah, I feel like really doing the calculation of, like, is this move easy to hit versus will this move give me a lot of damage? Yeah. If the move's really easy to hit, then it doesn't matter if it doesn't give you a lot of damage. Yeah. And vice versa. But if it's you're doing a move that's hard to hit and doesn't give you that much of a combo at that percent, then what are you bloody playing at? <laughs> Truth. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no rest. <laughs> oh, my. Really fortunate from Luma, but good awareness to, like, no... Luma's playing the roll spacing a lot. Yeah. Uh, good on Ella not to roll, though. The game's still looking grim. She's really going to pull it together here. The thing is, look, look at the percent Luma's gone that to twice. There's no, like, explosive, like good decision making. There's a lot of attempts at like up smashes, but then she will just like start clipping him with like shines and like weak bears and like nares. Yeah. Just need to really pick your poison better. And you see, look, this is just going to keep happening and happening. Especially like, like look at the amount of times the guy plays shield, you know? Yeah, like the reason that uh, Leffen wow. kind of solved the puff matchup for a while is because he was like the main player who really like honed in on always picking the right move at the right percent. Yeah, and no conversion on the up throw there. <laughs> no shorten. Pretty clean from Luma. Um, counter pick, you got Yoshi's FD, FD, and you got Stadium. Stadium, yeah. You got Yoshi's. Probably banned Stadium. I think FD, uh, I like it. It also might make Ella play in a more sensible way to match up, I guess. Yeah. I'm not sure. Because a couple of times also she um, went for like trying to hit the top on the platform in such a way that she just get grabbed. Yeah. No, I feel that. That's. Oh. Yeah, that's that's actually, that's actually coaching. <laughs> what Alex screaming, you can jump way earlier than that. Yeah. Yeah, I don't, I don't like that. Alex, problematic once again. <laughs> that's actually just don't yell. At <laughs> oh. Just like you can convert uh, there. <laughs> yeah, exactly. They always take it. Yeah. <laughs> that's fucked. That one's actually really fucked. <laughs> Because also the other person hears it and they're like, do I? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, alright. Yeah, it's a rough spot. Fishing for back airs now. You can probably laser board, to be honest, with this present. Because, like, oh my, absolutely kicked. <laughs> kicked! Oh, oh, kicked. oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me we have sore, sore stomachs. <laughs> it's like, oh, oh. <laughs> uh, Yeah, I feel like Ella needs some time in the old Uncle Punch. This is a specific event developed by Uncle Punch. Where he's up for a puff. Trouble puff. And it's not Uncle Punch, it's Achilles in 20XX. Achilles. Achilles? A a yeah, I was going to say, do you want me to say Achilles? <laughs> have you seen that video? No. Oh, dude, it's good. 
H <laughs> It's like a guy playing Wheel of Fortune, and he gets the whole word. It's like Achilles mythological hero. <laughs> or it's Achilles mythological hero, and he's like Achilles mythological <laughs> hero. And the guy's like, Yeah, sorry, you can't accept that. Yeah, that's <laughs> uh, actually. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ageless. Yeah, and then he like flubs three more things. Hey, he's saying ageless. Uh, it's like on the spot decision, thing. and it's got like two letters missing, and he's like on the spot Super dice chase. spin. <laughs> dice spin. <laughs> <laughs> wow, Bubba Steve. We were laughing, and it filled Ella with good power. Now she's <laughs> exactly positive energies. Yeah, hello, big SA Nick fan. Who wouldn't be in this uh, <laughs> day and age? Yeah. <laughs> See, like, alright, you got the running shine. Just grab. What are you scared of? Like, what burst option is, is Pop Puff gonna pick on the floor? Oh, this is weird. Oh my, absolutely beautiful and grab. Oh, is that it? Wow, I didn't even press up B. Climb the crowd. Oh, this is so lame. What are you doing here? This is so lame. You would do this too. Yeah, I would. And it'd be lame for the other person. <laughs> just saying sorry, man. <laughs> yeah, it's just business. The thing is, man, it's just... Uh, there's not even up throw up on the table. She can't hit it. She's shown time after time. She hasn't hit an up throw up it. Oh, that's it. <gasps> that's uh, a little bit of a choke from Luna. Oh, he's alive, yeah. Yeah, Ellis is gonna like try and fish with a random up air or up smash, I think. Yeah, you can't even. She's gonna run it up smash. Oh, dash attack, insane. And Luma is terrified. He's not getting any of his out of shot conversions. That's it. In the words of the melee audience. Fuck. Oh. Yeah. 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 <laughs> 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 the look he gave me. Uh, oh, well. oh, there she goes. You can't win them all. And would you even want to? Win them all? Yeah. Yes. Nah, you wouldn't have any perspective on the, the highs and the lows of life. Ah, uh, Nick. You get jaded. That's why so many rock stars, you know, become disillusioned with life. <laughs> Don't know where I was going with that. <laughs> can't go there. Right on. <laughs> Okay, so a little scared of Muscat. Oh, this is a crazy match. Oh, we got Muscat. Oh, I was scared for a sec there. I thought he was. <laughs> <That's right. laughs> the, 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 the straight up fuck tag. I thought he was going to rage face a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> it's been since Thursday with this shit for me, guys. you got to understand. Dude, Fest probably like one of the main instigators of meme culture in the, in the game house. Yeah, he's just Spud will say something and he'll be like, <laughs> and then we'll like tag along with it. I'm like, stop. Also, he just like quotes frame data in like real life situations a lot. Fess? Yeah. Or, like, yeah, no, I'm like, Fess is the melee reference guy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that was cool. Musket shielding. Daring. Really. On the damage. Musket like very positional based player, like not uh doesn't have the biggest punishes, but like always trying to have that good position. And that was crazy like attempted setup for Musket as well. Yeah. He like gets the like fall off shine from the Ooh, wind from back in there. I can see yeah. Musket doing it right here. Down smash. Oh, no. He, the idea is there, though. The thing is with Fess is he, being around Spud so much, his ideas are probably fucked right now. Yeah, like, Fess is really good against Fox, but I think he takes a few games to, like, decide what kind of Fox he's playing against a lot of the time. Yeah. He doesn't have, like, a good, a one, like, day one game plan, I feel. Yeah, Musket, I was talking to Dumby about Musket before, and Musket, and Dumby saying, uh, doesn't really understand how Musket gets wins, because his punish game is not that developed, and his, like, tech skill is not that good, but I think, like, really goes to show the importance of just, like, pure fundamentals in melee, and yeah. he's able to get wins. Yeah, like, these hits are all great, is that it? Yeah, wow, that's, that's scary sometimes. When like, you see the percent tick up when they're in the top last zone, yeah, yeah. it terrifies you. Wow. Yeah, it's just positional play. He's just waiting oh, in good spots. Right. 
To be honest, that was a really bad roll as well. Yeah. But like the fear, he's like, this is all like, like grassroots level of like, like old school. Just this guy's gonna do this because he's scared. And like a lot of new school players are so obsessed with hitting everything before they can move. Yeah. But they just don't give themselves time to just like understand that this guy's gonna do a shit option. And Fess also the kind of guy to be like many layers deep in his own head about an option when it's actually like. Musket, just keeping it simple, keeping it like level one. Yeah, that's a net. Oh, I don't like that. Even, that, that wasn't a true train guard. Musket kind of sees things as they are, and Fest sees them as they like could be. In a Should, yeah, car. yeah, no, no, that's exactly right. And that can often lead to a scary mentality. Oh, you gotta hit that. Oh, you gotta punch that too. Fest is playing really scared right now. I like that Musket missed it and then hit. Crazy. Missed it and didn't try to like clean up with some other secondary option that would have lagged him even more. Look at fucking Musky's face right now. <laughs> he hasn't moved. Is the camera frozen? <laughs> no, it's not. That's a really good game of base, actually. He hasn't moved. He's just considering the situation, man. Uh, calm, cool, calculated. The, the camera looks frozen. His eyes say different. That was a great aim. Musky has been playing like energy saving techniques all day, actually. So. <laughs> Really he's is. in power saving mode. All of his processing power is going towards game where Fest is going to be at any good moment. Oh, great lasers. And you got. Oh, that's a fuck shot. Laser, laser, down smash. Yeah, yeah I like that. The red act combo. This is scary. This could be everything there. Oh, Falco Shine. Too small, low tier character. Yeah, and that Fest was actually a good charge there because usually it was, um, he was just waiting for the roll every time. And it's like, it's scary. Like, people don't just like instantly decide something else. They'll wait a bit and go like, all right, well, he's read the roll. And that was good. What were also, we gonna say? Also, Musket getting tech chases, where Fess always has respect for the good player not grabbing if they're, they're never gonna be late. And so he wants one dodge ever. Yeah. He'll do some option. And Musket just like a tiny bit late, but gets the, gets the, the grab. grab anyway, yeah. That's what I was thinking against Fess. I was like, well, I can just grab this guy even though I'm like taking place when I miss the reaction. Yeah. Because no. he's like expecting me to do something good. JB, help me. Yeah. <laughs> just watching some sticks. You have a good one, man. Yeah, that was good. I like that instant um, like aerial shine like out of shield into like an aerial. There's like shine double jump bear out of shield. It's very challenging to react to in DI. It's scary, yeah. Because you're like holding. Oh, oh, it's so smart. A billion IQ air dodge by Musket. Great, great laser. I don't know like how deliberate it was, but no, I didn't it wasn't even credit. He just missed. <laughs> but he he air dodged into the laser though, and he couldn't have lived if it wasn't the laser. No, but yeah, he's... <laughs> Ooh, good double there. Yeah. I reckon it was genius IQ. Okay, cool. People in SA kind of smart. Oh, you know, it's because we value different things here. It's like you know how. Oh, good spacing. In uh, spot states, everyone values swag. Well, because I live here and I'm the big influence, you know. People just value intelligence. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think, Victor? Other than customers, what do you think, Victoria <laughs> slash Cindy? Uh, I don't know. Just the will to win. Game Unintentional sense. game sense. Exactly. Doing whatever it takes. <laughs> Thanks, man. <laughs> Oh, they got the rolls coming up again. And Caster entering the venue just in time to see her brother owning Musket. Owning, oh, uh, not this Never game. Never mind, man. don't look, Catherine. Don't look. <laughs> your eyes. <laughs> oh, yeah. Musket, I do feel, is much better on triplat stages. Yeah, I was just saying. I think this could have been like the best band for him, to be honest. Just bringing it back here. The thing is, though, you got to keep a strong mentality. His face is still not moving. It's a bit quiet right now. But there's not really much to say. That no, I just saw Musket take a laser and dash back into the same laser, and then yeah. dash back into the same laser three times, <laughs> which is good. He's like, yeah, look, laser damage is going to be why I lose at the end of the day. It's true. And then he got the nair and killed him. Oh yeah, wow. That's D-Gen spam right there. Yeah. Did you hear that? That was crazy, man. It just goes through the <laughs> Oh, there we go. Oh, there we're back. <laughs> Maybe we're getting out wires. There's no way he this. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. Yeah, he does. He can just grab ledge as well, he didn't have to go out there. Yeah. 
You can go out there though, you gotta be better at it though. Yeah. Like, you can lift easy. Game 3 scenario yet again. And what an enthralling Bulls game here. We're going to the story. Musky wants to get a shine. Maybe two. Oh. That's such a. I think it's mainly the up airs. I feel like Musky yeah. go from up airs more than anything. Yeah, top platform is such a rough spot to be stuck on the stage against Fox. This stage, most of the time, sometimes like the shines just send you off. Like Great slide 90, up, by the way. Yeah, ninety percent of the time, the laser, the shines just gonna make you hit ledge. The thing is though, like with the space that Musky plays at, it's just like first kind of has to be a bit more aggressive, but Musky just wants that. He just has to be better with it though. Good shine. It's literally Musky's so standing cool. still, yeah. Oh, that's good now, and that's it. You just gotta grab edge. Musky's the coolest player, man. He's <laughs> actually become the swaggest. Yeah, I think, you know, it's like they say, oh, either you die a lame or you live long enough to become a swag man. Oh, you have to, if you're gonna get the, the juicy, fat fucking up air, falling up air, you hit the floor, you can do anything. The world's your oyster, you gotta convert off it. Yeah, must get not a fan of oysters. <laughs> Put that shellfish allergy. He looks at the seafood, he's got a little yucky. <laughs> couple, of, a couple of allergic boys right here. Yeah. He's got the shellfish allergy and Fess. Uh, Hard allergic to all nuts. Had to ask if the beer we had last night had any nuts in it. Yeah, we got laughed at by the weight stuff. I was getting laughed. I didn't even <laughs> ask. <laughs> Good read, though, yeah. Covering legend and, and straight. This is a bit closer than I thought it'd be. I think it's mainly tournament pressure for the best. Musky actually so bull bum belected. <laughs> he really is bull. <laughs> belected. <laughs> <laughs> you ever heard that song? No. It's great. Is Shout it out like to Christian YG or something. I don't know who it is. All I know is that <laughs> Christian used to run around the house going, I'm bull bomb with elected, bitch. <laughs> and he is. Just like Musky. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, yeah. That's really good. This, this is the scary part for Fox. You got the lead. I love that to like all of us, you are like the Zuma younger brother, but you have like a Zuma younger brother of your own. Yeah, it's like a Zuma around dupe the house. Yeah, like yeah, Zuma. <laughs> <laughs> Truly a Zuma Zuma. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, get out Kills of here! All his homies, he says. Kill him! Oh, so smart! Uh, that's actually a game-changing read here. Like I was saying, though, scary part for fog. Sometimes you just don't start hitting those punishes. You just like, I just need to win. There's no just like instant shine dare that you can hit. There's up throw shine or whatever, but like even then, it's pretty hard. And Musket in that same situation as he was before gave Fest the chance to CC the jab, and Fest didn't match it out in time. So, oh, you gotta, you gotta hit it. Oh, this is Genesis. Oh, that's oh. Genesis right there. And Fest taking almost no Last damage, almost no surcharge on that stuff from Fest. <laughs> Remember your trainings as well. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the shine that shit just always cleaning anymore. Who wants it more? The up it hits. Oh, it's... oh you gotta take those. That's the man. To Jordy! <laughs> Oh, this is so close. And must get known to have a little bit of a choky moment every now and then. That's it. Oh, Fest takes it, clutches it. That was Genesis, and Fest, in fact, did win Genesis. That's it. Hbox DQ'd. <laughs> That's fourth place at the Big Cheese right there. <laughs> That's the sock, my son. Christ almighty. When's round two? Oh, we got Dean back up. Oh, we got a swag man and his little glasses. Dean versus Brad. <laughs> Hopefully Brad's taking some time to collect his thoughts. Yeah. <laughs> Remember why he's here. Mm -hmm. Take mm -hmm. a little bit of a chill pill. Build a bridge and bloody get over it. <laughs> Fucking hell, man. <laughs> <laughs> Chillax. Relaxing, eating. Yeah. Oh. What are some other idioms that mean get over it? Don't have a cow? Don't, yeah, don't have a cow. Build a bridge. Yeah, it's a dog. Damn. <laughs> Calm your farm. Oh, I like that. That's good. My brain hurt, man. This light is being in my eyes for like two hours. Yeah. It has not been two hours. It's been like one hour, maybe. Max. Ah, uh, what is it? DMY? Is it, is it Simpsons? Don't mess yourself. 
And we got Falcon, we got Fox, we got Matchup. <laughs> mm, who do you think's got this? Dean? I think renowned for owning owning Brad at, at BAM. Renowned? Yeah. That's what I know him for. Oh, is that, that's the guy that beat Brad? <laughs> yeah, BAM. In convincing, earth shatteringly <laughs> easy conditions. Yeah. But Brad, renowned for being a Fox player. <laughs> Being a fox man sucks. It's just like no one knows you. You know, unless you're the best. Yeah. It's like, oh great, another fox. You're just fodder in the, in the grand scheme of life. Ready? Uh, I'm actually keen to see how this goes. Oh yeah, there's an instant retreating aerial. Alright, who do you reckon is going to get the first kick? It was Brad. Kicks? Huh? Yeah, I was going to say all kicks. Then. Yeah. <gasps> <gasps> kicks! <laughs> That's the <laughs> truth. Oh my, what a read. That was crazy. Dean's really saying, come at me, bro. <laughs> oh, that's hard. That's a hard conversion there. And Brad's saying, yeah, I will. I'll oblige. That's fine. <laughs> I'll just... Good tech. Look, if this situation will, you know, be over with, I'll pay that $9. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> While Nick keeps making <laughs> references to it, last night <laughs> we're at the restaurant. And, <laughs> like, we did all the calculations and paid separately, and they're like, there's still $9 left to pay. And we're like, why? And she's like, yeah, I don't know, I've done all the math, and, um, yeah, they, they still, you guys still have to pay $9. And we're like, alright, but you've added everything together, we've done the math. She showed us the receipt, and she's like, yep, so it should only just be, yep, you guys have paid the right amount. I'm like, okay. And she's like, yeah, so I don't, can... and then and she's like, I don't mind if you guys, like, split the $9 payment. And we're like, what the fuck are we paying for? <laughs> like, she's like, so, and then she's like, oh, there is a credit card surcharge. We're like, it's like a dollar. It's a dollar. Yeah, no, she's like, there's a 1% credit card surcharge. <laughs> and we're like, how is that $9? And she's like, yeah, look, if you guys just want to pay it, that's fine. And she's going to get a staff member go like, look, I don't get it. I've done all the math here and it's fine. And then she's just like, yeah. And we're like, oh, we're there for like 10 minutes. And she's like, okay. <laughs> And we're like, all right. And then she's like, yeah, if you guys just want to pay that, like, who wants to pay for it? And we're like, what are we paying for? And then Nick's like, I don't feel comfortable. No, I was, I was feeling hella comfortable. I told her that we weren't going to pay it. Miles wanted to make it, the problem go away with his credit, yeah, no, 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 credit card. No, no. Great quote is, oh my god. <laughs> yeah. Miles was like, I'll pay it. And I was like, no, you can pay me the money when I... <laughs> <laughs> it's the classic Nick, it's for the principal. <laughs> Anyway. And now there's been great surcharge memes. <laughs> surcharge has really been the story of the, uh, the, the household, yeah. And <laughs> it's just like Dean was a little bit of a surcharge on Brad right now, to be honest. <laughs> he's definitely surging. <laughs> oh, that's, oh, that crap. Oh, he got up. Oh, he's dead. That was a crazy crash cancel. It was, yeah. My favorite meme is, uh, <laughs> goes to cafe to, to eat salmon and eggs. Uh, <laughs> Mom, can I have some money to buy salmon and egg? <laughs> buy surcharge instead. <laughs> <laughs> <What's your boss? laughs> <laughs> like a boss. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's it. Go out there and knee him. Ooh, big of a truck there. Oh my. Cool idea from Dean. He'd be, he'd be wave landing off platforms and doing aerials. That <laughs> and Brad, feeling the pressure, feeling the heat. He's thinking lines. there's not that much leeway left in the pool for him to be losing yeah. sets, you know? No, no, you're right. Like, he's got, I mean, probably Dean and uh, Kalen are the, I mean, not Kalen, Miles were the, were the only two he really had to worry about, but like, you don't want to be like scraping through. Yeah. Oh! Oh. Fuck this stage. Oh. He's jumped back. Actually insane that three people out of a five person death, like, Matt Robin will make it through. Winners. Yeah, it's fucked. But all the more melee for the viewers. More gaming for me, yum yum. Ooh, yeah. Yep, can't be whiffing there. Right, kind of talking to himself, saying, I think he might be praying. <laughs> <laughs> what the, what time is it? Yeah, it's about prayer time. Oh, this calls. Damn, it's three already. Shout oh, out to Rex. here for a long time. And, uh, 
expertly punishes the gentleman miss. <laughs> <laughs> the Hesenic Gas gets me every time. Oh, he doesn't get the edge guard. You gotta, you gotta oh, hit those. Yeah. That's giant. <laughs> Brad coming alive on the Fountain of Dreams. Looking like a fountain of nightmares for Dean, dare I say. <laughs> but Dean, working the platforms. He's really been liking the like run of aerials this set. It's a close game. And a couple of times this match actually, Brad's just gone for a big old up smash. Yeah, yeah, and just died and for just it. Just died for it. Ooh, and it's there like, it is. see, even when he got it at the right percent, where it was going knocked down. He, he got 18. Only, yeah, he still only got the up smash. So gotta consider the risk reward there. Ooh. Oh my! The cranium Actually cracker. Actually insane. Read. Dean with a little bit of a grin there. Really hope he fucks off with that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, we get it, dude. You think you're nice. <laughs> you think you're sneak? Oh, fucking press back. Sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to hit you. really hard. <laughs> yeah, did it was that hard? Yeah, you can... Sorry. If you want to rewatch the mods there... The shadow... If anyone, if anyone in, in, oh, the, in the court of law wants to use that for evidence against Sora for assault, then it's Ooh. right there for you. Brad's just not pressing options here. We don't press options. They got Baju. That's probably it then. You don't need that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Side B. Oh, it's funny. Oh, he... What is happening here? Yeah, he'd be regularly getting up. Oh, it doesn't even look at him. Gets on the stage again. Ah. Good stuff. Dude. And if you're Brad, you hate to see it. But yeah. if you're Dean, conversely, you like to see it. <laughs> Two sides of the same the... coin. <laughs> really fighting the food chain there. I'm going to browse my phone for a second. I hope that's okay. Oh, my contact lens hurts. <laughs> it's not good. You're fucking owned, dude. I am owned. I swear. It's a family stream. Dude, this. <laughs> Let me hold on. The composition. Must <laughs> <laughs> sloth musky. Uh, Holy shit. It's good. All right. Who do you reckon's gonna be playing? Um, that is a great question. I wish speculate? I could ask you. Oh, it looks like we're under arrest. If you can see in the background, the police are uh, trying to trying to put some pressure on the event runners, trying to really flex their power. I don't really understand what's going on here. <laughs> Big fan of the A cab movement right now. Looks like Jack standing peacefully protesting. Yeah, <laughs> he's just and, like. Uh, Hopefully he can keep the situation peaceful. I just don't know. We know anymore. things can escalate. If you've seen Hong Kong, you'll know what I mean. Oh <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, man. <laughs> I want to say back to the match, but there's nothing here. <laughs> uh, it's not, it's not that funny. <laughs> <laughs> the government <laughs> attacking the people. But hopefully we can get the situation sorted and uh, we can we can get this bribe paid and move on with our lives. Big Cheese not paying the commentators here. <laughs> yep. All of our money actually going to the uh, protection racket against the uh, police. <laughs> so <laughs> We're bribing. <laughs> What's it called? Flo, we going outside there just to pay the bribe. They don't take stubby holders as payments. Bit of a fuck there. Unfortunately. Yeah. Luckily, all the top players did agree to donate 10% of the pot money as well to, uh, oh. to the forces that be. The forces that be. The powers that do. You know, you know how it is. Pog is, dude. That's all people I gotta say. People in the crowd. In the IRL chat. <laughs> Getting involved. And we've got Kaiser. And we've got Campbell. Ooh, Kaiser, Dude, Kaiser and Geordi are in the same pool. They're going to be on stream, surely. No, they played off stream, Kai won. Are you, you, are you trolling? No, they literally played off stream before. And Kai Geordi won. and Kaiser played off stream. You didn't say, they were literally playing right there. I was watching it. What kind of shambolic... What are, what, what are, what are they paying Kai for? <laughs> Know, Nick, nothing. did you really just eat that hook line and sink off? No, I put it. No, it was <laughs> what I'm saying. They didn't play off stream, dude. <laughs> I thought you were like, because I like rubbed my nose, and I thought you were like 
Did Think you eat the booger? No, oh, yeah. No. <laughs> and I was like, no. Booger boy, booger <laughs> boy. <laughs> Oh, oh, you really got out there, bro. That's an epic troll, man. You just said what wasn't true, and I <laughs> Yeah, no, we talked about that yesterday. It's just like the best of jokes. It's like, here's fact. It's just like, okay, it's, I like, hope, he, he, it's I, not fact. I hope none, none of the people in the chat were also fooled by that <laughs> epic troll. Sorry, guys. This is a yeah, Jordy and Kai actually haven't played. Uh, he, just, we, he just said that they had for a joke. Give me a <laughs> Campbell's playing... Good, but still go behind, yeah. Let's bring it back. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's like, it's playing insane to... Oh, we got Monkey, and we do not have Nobs, unfortunately. Nobs? Dude, do you remember Jeff Fantastic vs. Uh, Hard Pelican? I didn't find it that funny. It was just sad. <laughs> it was so fun. I found it mainly funny because I felt, like, implicated because I was the one that put him on commentary. Because, <laughs> like, me and Gareth did the first half of the set, and we just saw Jet in chat, and he was like, can I commentate? And I was like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is before you really did it. It was a, it was wow. a simple attack. That was a great bet. It kind of looked like the, the cat just hit. <laughs> his eyes just went in the back of his fucking head. Yeah, good dare. Wow, great, great tag. tag. Smart. Good follow up to get him off, but like... Those bears are so tricky to deal with. Yeah, that's annoying to deal with. It's so fast. Uh, Kai literally would just sit on the platform and shield and wait for you to do something. Yeah. Yeah, not exactly the, the most custom player. He's custom off hit occasionally, and he's occasionally custom with his movement. But like, when he's on that platform, he's down to shield. What, what are you doing, Kai? Probably trying to shield our laser or something. <laughs> There was absolutely no need for a sh laser shine turnaround way dash the ledge there. Yeah, but uh, if you can do it, why not? Yeah. Let him know. What does Kai's shirt say? Six scenes. All the six scenes. Lost Camp Pessinos. That's one of Kai's favorite bands. They're like an 11-piece uh, indie band. Mm. One of them plays violin. They did the song in uh, a combo video Kai made for one of my friends, not from Smash, for TF2. Oh! That I saw somehow before knowing Kai. Oh, that's actually a little crossing paths there. That's a day, yeah. It's an insane like collection of knowledge that only I could possibly have access to. You know? <laughs> Yes, Nick. We know Nick. Wow, laser reset there. No, I'm just saying, like, I happen to know those two people and the band, and then watch this random Fuck, frag video. <laughs> it's just all the pieces were lining together. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He missed the AC there, but it still didn't matter. Actually, accounting for missing the AC there is fucked. Kai kind of running away with this one. Oh. Very custom from Campbell. I love accidentally custom. I feel like this is the perfect level of play to accidentally get custom. Yeah. Because you're still good enough to kind of be able to pull it together after you mess up, but you are going to mess up a lot. Yeah. After that. Oh, that's a very custom up air spacing. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Dude, oh. I'm trying to read some kind of third dimensional movement from Kai. Nick. Last year, maybe, the spamming of the custom would have worked, but we didn't have an intervention here. Uh, I feel like custom has evolved to mean bad. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's like you think you custom? <laughs> like now it just means like the person serving us is rude or like. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's just like that way just is fucking custom. <laughs> Ooh. Shout out to the waitress who actually served us. Though. She, was, she amazing. was amazing. That was easily the best waitress I've ever had. Yeah. She was sparking conversation. She, I like heard me, she heard me talking about how um, when I play Spud, it's like lights on, like just getting my head slammed into the wall, getting fucked from behind, it doesn't matter. But with SA Nick, it's just like the lights are off, you know, the socks are on. Yeah, she understood what She was laughing her ass. The socks are definitely on. Yeah, this <laughs> the socks are definitely on. Yeah, this is like almost an impossible comeback with our Kai players. Yeah. <gasps> Don't look at me post gasp, please. And that Kai it? takes that pretty convincingly 2 0 against Campbell. Yeah. My favorite move that the wait, wait, waitress did was uh, when she was standing up and she was like domin 
dominant in body language. Yeah. And so she lowered herself to the level of the table to like talk about drinks. Yeah. She was like, well, this is the drink I like. She was trying to ask, howdy. Very, very... Uh, Probably Donny versus Dean coming up here. Very yeah. good body language use. I was going to say, a little bias coming from Zion in the crowd there. Yeah, I'm going for Don B. Bit of a shit cunt. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, can't say that, bro. Did my headphones just die? <laughs> did, I just, did I just accidentally get muted? I can hear you, but I can't. Try speaking, Nick. Hello. Just yell into the mic. Just yell into the mic. Okay, no, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's good. Nick, I need you to scream. <laughs> I'm fine, yeah. I was like, I, I questioned it, thankfully. <laughs> I miss impulse, Nick. <laughs> I can't. If Jordy had put us on speakerphone, <laughs> he would have got kicked out of Kmart. <laughs> so. All sorts would have been yelled. <laughs> Miles with the fist up. Prepped, ready to go. Need what do you think of hairy up. arms, Nick? I got him. Yeah, bingo. I get called disgusting for my hairy arms sometimes, and it makes me uncomfortable. By who? Who would say that? Non wogs. Disgusting. Yeah, they think it's gross. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Jokes on them when uh, whatever biological purpose they serve doesn't happen to them. What is the use of hairy arms? I don't know. My arm hella warm. <laughs> Exactly. Yeah, good edge guard there. Don't be saying, if it ain't Spud's Falcon. Hard pass. Oh, gets the kicks. Oh. <laughs> you have to do the oh. Oh. <laughs> Don't be like. <laughs> you know in like the um the 50s cartoons when it's just like you rile up like the like a someone who's like a really tough guy. He's like. <laughs> he starts like pulling up his sleeves, like, why? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That was literally what Donnie did today. He shook his head, he's like, <laughs> <laughs> He's like tapping his feet, he's like, fucking tough guy, huh? <laughs> Actually, incredible. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, it's just what they do. When they start slapping their face, like, it's like the Three Stooges. It's like, <laughs> like, listen here, guy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's actually the classic. I love looking at him too. He looks like he's gonna drop the fattest diss track or fattest shit of 2019, and we just don't know what's gonna come out. What, Don Beer? Yeah, look at him. Oh, not I yet. like how perfectly poised Dean is, actually. Yeah, Dean's up. pursing his lips. Very kissable. Shout out to Jess. Imagine the privilege, you know? Yeah, must be nice. Mm. Ooh, no slide off there. Oh, you gotta take that. Oh, you can't take that actually. Two low percent. Dean's really good at double jumping to just get out of these situations. Which is, oh, and we got the, the we got the police knocking at our door right now. Yeah, kind of giving me a death stare. I don't know why. Yeah. Oh. He's probably just trying to get into melee. Yeah. Hey man, I heard you were one of the top players. <laughs> <laughs> it's like I'm an up and coming math man in my precinct. Yeah, I, I used to play as a kid actually. And I, I haven't there. played for 40 years, but I've. <laughs> Great CCD tool. I haven't played for 40 years. <laughs> oh, oh wow, that was cool. Don't, cool don't, SD. Don't disrespect. Yeah. Yeah, Tony's just like, yeah, you wanna fucking act tough? Like, oh, I'm. <laughs> 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 the three stooges are actually just godlike. Now I think about it. The Tricast should have just been called the Three Stooges, dead ass. I feel like every Tricast ever has been called that though. The Three Stooges? Or the Three Musketeers. Depending on like the level of professional. Oh my Ooh. god. It's basic for being on the shield there, but it gets all the way out of there and changes all the point of pressure. Oh, you can't tilt it there. I feel like Dean. Uh, in yeah. that situation he did well, he held center stage really well, but a few times he's had the corner pressure and he's like, giving it up. Yeah, no, for sure. He's just like, he really values retreating a bit too much, I reckon. But it's hard to be angry in this matchup. By yeah. angry, I mean aggressive. <laughs> <laughs> right. Easy to be angry, to be honest. Yeah. Shoutouts to IBDW versus none. Come on! <laughs> 
definitely a. <laughs> <laughs> And I'm just like, huh, and he's like, why I <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's good. Oh shit. People don't do menacing like they used to. Menacing? It's like, you think you're sick, bro? Huh? Exactly. Huh? And it's just like cutting the other guy off is more like the play, the Chad play now. Yeah. At least we used to, we used to have manners back in the day, you know? Yeah, let him finish. That's yeah, Black Shadow. The man himself. Really late to the morning, actually. Yeah, no, he's just wave two, please. Yeah, but he's still like, we should have started like an hour ago, right? Not wave two. Wave two started at two o'clock. Oh, it's. Oh. Dude, I saw it, it was like 12.50, and I was like 2.50. Yeah, no, I got it. Stupid, stupid. Oh, good knee. Oh my god! Oh, shit. That's. A, I'm gonna punch something, That's man. That's literally everything. Oh, oh you wow. Back end. You gotta go down. That was a fucked magnet, though, and that's probably alive and well. The There's just screams. Screaming in anguish. <laughs> I can't stop looking at him. Just gonna... I don't be with the Johnny. Definitely the monkeys coming out of the zoo at this tournament every time. Yeah. <laughs> it's just Ape Escape 4 at this point. I feel like that's pretty much every Australian tournament. No, sometimes it's a little more quiet. Like a band, there's a lot of like wows and ooh. Dean loves a uh, read tech in place. Or miss tech. And then read uh, full cut afterwards. Oh yeah, yeah, it's insane read. I wish I missed it looking at the crowd. Yeah. My bad. Oh, you got a shield grab there. Oh, that yeah, stunt was bad. It's exactly course. the same read you got against Brad, but he just like missed the tech read and then just like. No jump, no jump. Oh, that back game reverses. That's Still no jump. Oh. Yeah, no, great, great hold there. Good stuff. Yeah. Ooh, that's a dream wave, but to no avail. But to what end? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> to what end? To what end? All this effort and, and for what? All for naught. For the other guy to hold the ledge and uh, <laughs> to simply stand up. Shake your hand and. I mean, it's away. better to have gamed than never to have gamed at all. To have gamed and lost. No. I didn't lose anything. He's lost like one set. Well, cool. He's still in bracket tomorrow, yeah, man. Yeah, he lost. That's what I'm saying. It's better to have gamed and lost than to never have gamed at all. I don't know what you're trying to quote. I just made that one up. Um, you know what I'm trying to quote? You know, like loved and lost, and never to have loved. Why do you say loved and lost then? <laughs> <laughs> he actually looks just broken, man. <laughs> no, I, I misquoted it. It's stupid, stupid. It's better, to have mis it's better to have attempted to quote something and misquoted it than to have never attempted to quote that thing at all. Am I right, chat? It's <laughs> <laughs> like one person in chat. <laughs> just the one homie. Ready? Oh, has, has the pods. It's not pod. Oh, they're not hand warmering. Decker straight in there with the four dares and the nares. And Decker are not bad at this matchup, honestly. Um, yeah. He plays Splice a lot, and Splice could never ever beat him. Luma already up 2-0. Never mind. <laughs> but I do think Splice had that big syndrome of uh, losing to Decker after five years. Sorry. Sorry, man. Sorry, I know, I know. Just, a, just one commentator living in the moment. <laughs> There's no commentator. Oh, that's loud. That's my bad. Using a smartphone. Smartphones are dumb people, am I right, Chad? <laughs> I knew you were a boomer, dude. <laughs> Since day dawn. Whatever happened to real conversation, am I right, Chad? <laughs> <laughs> interacting one way with the chat and talking about real interactions. <laughs> am I right? Am I right? And they, they, you just assume they say yes. <laughs> Press one if you agree with everything I'm saying right now. And like three people press one out of a 500 person chat, and it's like, that's enough. Yeah. I'll take it. Deck can't really be trolling right now. He literally stood there and F smashed like four times in a row, maybe. Dekka full drew forward fair out of shield, no fastball. Oh! Deck are trolling ridiculously hard, and Luma getting owned. Luma needs to figure out how to make Dekka swing from ranges where he's close enough to punish. That's like the the crux of this matchup is like the Dekka matchup. 
of any tough moth matchup. It's how can I be close enough to the moth that I can punish him? Yeah. But make him swing. Yeah. And don't get hit by the swing. Like, and, yeah. F Smash is just perfectly covering the space Luma's comfy at. Maybe he just doesn't play against Master F Smash like that. That's taking place, yeah, every time. <laughs> even though it was a fat tech roll, right? And even when Luma's getting the punish, he's getting like one back at Dave's big. literally just spamming F Smash. You gotta get big against the uh, Master. Oh. It's true. Like, crowd, shield, wave, wow. which is really good, and like, poking with back airs. Uh, you can do that, like, you know how with Fox you can kind of dare Moth's, like, early part of his shield up if he's trying to do a late, or, like, vice versa? Yeah. Like, he would often dare through me in spots where I thought I could react, like, when we were early on and out. Yeah. Uh, Ooh. playing through <sighs> Puff can kind of do the same. She can go in with back airs early or late and, uh, mix up. And once Ooh. you hit it back air with Puff, there's, like, so much money to be had in Moth being off stage. And yeah, back air is. Yeah, back is just ridiculous. It's just like the the tool. It's just like they hold away. They're in an edge guard spot. Hold in. It's another one. You know, you never. I, yeah. This matchup it takes so much practice. And so much getting used to as buff. Yeah. As buff, to be fair. It's I mean, like living one. in Tasmania with probably like no mass at all. Oh, you gotta rest that. Oh, you can't rest it. I guess. 100. But Deca probably would have died off the buff. Yeah. <laughs> That's the player read. He'd be holding in. <laughs> This is such a battlefield tune. Dare I say it's the battlefield tune? No, there's two songs in every stage. Yeah, that was good. See, that's all you need. You like whiff punish with the back air and then just get like some kind of read on the side B. Yeah. And now it's rest percent. Or rest territory, I guess. Oh, that's gonna kill. Yeah. Just scrape the little gum off the floor. Yeah. Hopefully Luma learned something from that. Um, I know I did. Yep, it's that F smash is unbeatable. <laughs> you shield it, doesn't matter. Do it again. <laughs> Spin with a damn, that's crazy. Crazy how godlike F smash was before people knew how to wave dash. Yeah, ridiculous move. Oh, Puff actually being able to crouch under standing grab doesn't really matter against Day, who's not a Jay Z king. Yeah. He's not really grabbing at all in this matchup. He's just swinging. But if he does. go back to the fundamentals of what a dash dance is and then apply it across. Like, a dash dance is when you go towards them, they feel threatened and swing, you drift back slightly and, like, evade the swing, yeah. and then hit them. And, like, he's just not doing it. He's just, like, in bad spots and trying to go in the right time. And it's so reactable as Puff and Puff. Yeah, no, definitely. Like, I never actually... <sighs> it takes a lot of experience to play this matchup, like you said before. I don't, yeah. I don't know. I don't think Loom is going to find the answer to that in day one. Like but maybe he'll be able to find Deco reads. Yeah. This is going to be mainly come down to player adaptation. Yeah, that's it. That was sick. Yeah, I think it's going to be a punish game carrying if Loom does manage to take this. Yeah. Imagine Deca coming third in this move. Ooh. That's scary. Yeah, Zane does this uh, really cool pivot F smash. I just want to see a little bit of that from Deca, you know? Yeah, maybe we'll see it next time. <laughs> next tournament. Yeah, ne maybe next grab he gets, he'll know to do it. Yeah, no. Nah. Oh All my right. god, that looks so cool when the blade just misses. Ooh, that's a big flop. Makes it back there. I think it like almost worked out better. You reckon? Because he would have missed the S man. And Luna just every time he takes a hit, he's just tanking it and going back over the floor there. Yeah. He's like kind of abandoned the idea of like cleanly playing the neutral and is like, okay, Yeah. Look, I'm just gonna like scramble. Yeah, like he's he's comfortable getting close because he knows he's out of shield game will be able to do it just like then. And he knows that Deckard's swinging with moves and like drifting forwards a lot. Whoa, so brutal. So that like if Deckard misspaces something, then he's always got like a fair that he can challenge Moth with. Yeah. Deckard looking kind of bored. That's yeah. the usual kind of game, I guess. But, uh, Great tipper. <laughs> that pound from the ledge is so bad against Moth. 
Like, what's a hit in? Yeah. He, just, he didn't do it deep. I think it can only be good if you, like, jump all the way in, and then when you're about to land, you pound it. It's so the max silly. Distance. It's just really silly. I'm like, just getting up air rested. Yeah, this is one of those, like, watching a low-level ICs type situation. Yeah. Where, like, you can tell that Lumi doesn't really understand how the matchup works that well. But every now and then he gets that hit to death. Yeah. Holy shit, Geordi's fit so fresh. Yeah, it's not the same boy. It's like good. Geordi always be looking good these days. He does. He could be looking good up. He could be looking what are you saying? He could be looking good. Duh. How? <laughs> what? I don't know, I just need to see the shades on. Oh yeah, that's true. <laughs> he actually looks so fresh. Ooh. I actually don't know what I'll do if Dave loses this. I may cry. The thing is, it totally invalidates me going up to Limer and teaching him how to play this matchup. He yeah, because he's like, no, I'm good. Yeah. If he loses and I'm like, yeah, this is what you're doing wrong, I feel like I have a platform. <laughs> but if he wins, it's like, yeah, no, actually the way you play this is just wait for Dave to like, Has Luma played Nangs yet? I suspect Nangs will win. Well, that Milo practice would be huge, yeah. Nangs is good at that matchup. Just <laughs> closed his eyes. Wow. That I can't believe that worked. After he like, he showed his hands so many times. Yeah. And One thing that's really good and really fast well, that works on stage is like only pretty much this in Yoshi's is back throw up air at high percents. Because yeah. um, it kills at like 110. Di dependent. Uh, yeah. Assuming that they're going to di away for the F throw. Yeah. yeah. But a lot of the time with puff, it's a mix up that's like it doesn't matter whether you down throw or F throw because the amount of lag on the down throw is so much less. Yeah. Yeah. You mean F throw? Sorry. Uh, both. Like, you know how down throw is usually the much slower throw? Yeah. Because puff's so light, they're actually more comparable. Oh, really? Yeah, like F throw and down throw. So, like, down, like when you want to get a follow-up with down throw or F throw to, like, fair or something, they're, like, kind of interchangeable and just DI best. Yeah. I mean, the same thing is with, um... So you can't really rely on puff DI-ing out for the forward throw, because puff is equally scared of both the forward and the down throw. Yeah. Yeah, no, that's fair. The thing is, back throw is also, um, weight dependent. It like, it's just a snap. It's a snap throw back. Oh my god. That's a big punish. No. Oh, if that was a roll, we'd have an even game. Maybe. Good spacing on that there, actually. I like yeah. That. I think Dave just needs to hold his ground more. And he needs to recognize, like, Puff is sometimes being allowed to just drift slowly down to Dave. And Dave's, like, shielding instead of doing a move. Yeah. Like, me or, like, Spud or someone with, like, better reactions with, like, up tilt or up air. Mm. Like, that one's different because he was in lag, but, um... I don't like that he's nairing. Nair is, like, pretty garbage against Puff in the spots that he's playing it. Also, very scary in this matchup is, like, roll into Puff and then up tilt. Wow. Because up tilt often shield pokes, and Luma is kind of going for that a lot in this game, which hasn't quite worked out, but, uh... It's gonna be a kill. Yeah, of course he's gonna swing there. He's swung there every time. Yeah, Luma trying to wait for the side B, but, um... Oh, good counter. Smart. Genius, huh? Magical. <laughs> Mythical. Oh god damn it. Oh, Decker, like he's already thrown away a big lead against Ruben. So it's not like out of the realm. Decker not the fortress of mentality that he used to be back in the day, I would say. Fortress of mentality. He was. He really was the clutchest guy back in the day, you know, that was his uh, forte. Shout out to Forte, who was also here today for uh, anime Ooh. games. <laughs> Oh. Oh, 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 I could have almost killed him. You reckon? Is that it? Oh, yeah, wow, that didn't even tip on it, just owned it. Yeah. I don't mind seeing it. It's good to see the king still around. I am inclined to get off commentary. Yeah, okay. I definitely need to warm up for Bracky. Should I get somebody? <laughs> Ella, Alex, commentary? I don't Nah. I don't. I, I can't really make the call. <laughs> After what? <laughs> well, I guess we're stuck here for one more set. Oh uh, well. Survival. <laughs> 
<laughs> You're ruining my jam, dude. This is a Vic local. Get me off. <laughs> uh, Ella Nick commentary. I'm gonna leave after this game anyway. Oh, wait, hold on. I'm gonna try and finesse someone. Uh, I'm sorry, Nick. I'm sorry. Dude, you. get two people. Get oh. You can leave if you get two people. No, I'm, I'm gonna leave regardless. Hold on. Ruben, can you come here a sec? <laughs> no. What's up? I need to get out of here. I'm still here somehow. <laughs> hey guys, very tired, Nick and Sora here. Hey guys, this is Hype. <laughs> and we've got Feth against PCG. PCG with an early lead. Oh, wait, Jesus. Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> PCG kind of the king of the uh, fox. <laughs> <laughs> Really overthrown musket on that one. Uh, post your uh, PC squeeze in the chat if you've got subscribed to a. Uh, Why is the stream lagging? What channel would have that? That's better. PC squeeze. <laughs> is that a real emote? No. PC squeeze is really funny. <laughs> Holy shit, he's fucking him up. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Best thinking. Uh, this is Genesis. Sorry, I, forgot. I didn't realize what I was thinking. He's probably thinking way faster than I was just then. Fess? Actually, Fess is not. Fess is thinking like. It's exactly what's happening Ooh. on screen. He's thinking yeah. down air. Fence hill. Fox is up in. Oh, great bait. Fess is like a. If you're feeling not very good, Alex might be one of the worst people to play against. Known for his force talk against SA Nick. Because right the thing is, he won't give you sh annoying combos you can cheese. Like, he won't go for, like, crazy tech traps. He'll go for, like, up throw back air and be content, you know? Like, he won't go for, like, up throw up air and, like, try Like, if he misses it, Fest finally gets that opening. Oh my god, I Alex is playing so well. Fest is like, uh, he's like Flow State, the, the person. Yeah. He's, oh, um, yeah, misses that. He's just thinking exactly what his senses are telling him. He's not thinking anything deeper. <laughs> He definitely is actually an overthinker, all jokes aside. Wow, you really got to slam in there. Wow, it's only two stocks. I thought he was on his last stop. Oh, Alex is fucking choking. Best is budging. Oh, yeah, Musker would hit that. Protect. Oh, no. He's going to take the shit out of this, too. Oh, my God. So Phantom smart. Dare. He's so intelligent from both players. That's fucked up. That's everything. That's a, that, that's a shit way for it to be Genesis. Oh my god. That's ridiculous. The fest is playing better now. Alex taking that flub all the way to Genesis Grand Finals. <laughs> Juan just like, that's crazy good stuff. <laughs> Juan just like runs up and gives Alex a hug. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh, swag. Oh, uh, it's a raid. Where's Sox? That's a great question. Maybe Sox you go and come. No, you know what? We're commentating well. Because I often criticize Alex's commentary. So we actually have to commentate well. <laughs> the, no. <laughs> I, can't, I can't have this. So. Oh, that's bad. Alex is trying to cheese it out with like, I mean, yeah. It's not really cheese. Here. He's just playing like pokey. Yeah. Gonna grab match there. And you hate to bloody see it. You hate oh to my fucking! You absolutely oh. hate. Oh, that. that is a. I knew it would happen too. I had it in my soul. I knew that would fucking happen. Oh. Hey, he can't be uh, oh. doing that. He be doing get meteored. I'm getting <laughs> fucked. <laughs> IBGF. And Fett starting off strong with all the momentum now. That's such mental damage for Alex. Oh, that's and it. And it's over. It's over. Alex really needs to dig deep. As I think yelling, it's over in earshot of the place. I'm yelling in the other direction. Sound is directional. Is it? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Find out. <laughs> 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 
Jordy and Catherine comms? Question mark. That would be dope. That's actually a hype idea. And Fest running away with this match. You kind of saw it coming. Like, Alex, you really need that game one when you're the underdog. Like the time when Alex forced stuck me in game one. You really needed it. <laughs> to have a chance you will need something. Yeah, Fest is just shining out shields now. That was a good uh, text chase setup. Oh, it's so over. Fest feeling the fury, if you will. Shout out to the sponsor. Yeah. Alex feeling a little squeamish. <laughs> <laughs> Look at up smash that as we talked about this. We've discussed this. <laughs> In saying that Fury paid for me, Fess, you, Spud, and um, what's who else is coming? And Marcus's flights to Genesis. They're just rolling in money. Yeah, we had to cover the search. <laughs> yeah, the search. <laughs> <laughs> GGs. Uh, 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 look, I'm actually just gonna. I'm cold abandoning this commentary. Don't do it. Uh, thank don't you so it. much. Don't do it. Don't do it. Huh? One more. Oh, for fuck's sake! It's Kai. Kai MSG. We gotta do it, dude. Uh, I want out of the uh, <laughs> Sock just walked in the venue. Sock, my son, he's dancing on stream. Dance, bust a move, do a dab. Do a dance, go in front of the camera right now. And dab. Floss, it's over there in front of the setup. Go, floss, floss, floss. He's gonna floss, he's gonna floss, he's gonna floss. He's gonna floss. What a fucking bitch, dude. Boo, what a bitch. Boo, boo, boo. Get off the stage. Get off the stage. Get oh, oh, God. Boo. Get this fucking guy out of here. <laughs> that was good, man. That was good. That was I really, really liked that. That was really sick. Oh, get that your old man a drink, yeah? <laughs> Oh, you get me an old. You get your old man a drink from the bar, yeah. You know I can't do that, Joshy. Yeah, yell that in front of the security guards, man. Really, <laughs> really off the wall. Get me off the stage. I just want to sit. Ah, Get me the fuck out of here, man. And we got Kai. We got Joshy. Don't know what any of you know. And last time yeah. these two met, we saw Kai with the 2 0 lead in Falco Dino. Then Jordy brought it all the way back Wait. with his Ganondorf. Ruben, can you get your old man a beer? <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. So, these two have a storied rivalry in Australian Melee. Starting off Don't when drink. they were both in contention for the Don't drink. top Roy in Australia. Tell me, do you want a drink or not? <laughs> Uh, nah, I'm good. Okay. And, and, uh, Jordy famously defeated Kai in a $200 money match. Roy did it. Oh, the classic. I still have our fortunes, by the way. Dude, my fortune sucks. My fortune is there are no strangers in this world. Just friends we've ever, we've never met. And fucking Fess's Fess. fortune, which I have on me. Like, you are the king. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah. So it's like, you can jump. Oh, no. This is Nick's fortune. That's fine. Mine's no. dope. Oh, no, yeah. Mine just, is just, you're old and judgmental. <laughs> it just says, you can judge your age by the amount of pain you feel when you come in contact with a new idea. That's which special. actually did happen yesterday it when did. I was talking about slide offs. I have not made any new friends, and I'm not really looking forward to doing that. I'm too tired for this. Fessa's fortune was so funny. It was just like, step on the backs of those who oppose you, king. Hey, what are the numbers on the back of fortune cookies? Are they like your lottery ticket numbers? <laughs> it looks Can I like buy a lottery ticket? With those numbers, yeah. yeah. I kind of do. They actually might just be lucky numbers. Yeah, I think they are. Or maybe it's like, the this is this is fortune number 2,812,000, you know? The king with the big cheese stubby holder. Yeah, hold on. Right, we need to change the stream cam then. Wow, I can't feel any coldness in my hands right now. Can I can I get the camera on me, please? I hope that beer isn't losing any of Can I get the camera on me? Can I get it? Can I get Oh my... Look, I, do you feel that? Do you feel cold at all? I don't want to grip this too tightly in case I warm the beer up. I, is, that, is that a hazard? No, the... no, of course not. Not with the stubby holder. Oh, because it's so well insulated. Yeah, because the stubby holder is actually keeping it cool. Keeping me bull balm and collected. And just, just so you can hear it. Oh. oh just, uh, and that's how nice you know you're going into a great set. Microsoft J vs Kai. <laughs> Thanks, man. <laughs> just getting robbed. And Jordy. I think Jordy <laughs> will Jordan. have a lot of pride going into this. And I, I to hope reclaim. He, because yeah. even though he beat Kai, he didn't get kind of trounced in the Falcon did it. Jordy's actually getting way better, I reckon. So Kai will be confident that he can win this matchup, and he'll be also be confident that he can overcome the Ganon. And Ooh, Jordy will have a lot to prove. I'm just short in there. He hates it. He honestly Shut do. the fuck up, Nick, man. You need to get out of here. Stop reading fortunes. Good man. Look, man Jordy's so much better than the last time they played. Which was, what, like one year ago? Yeah. 
That's true, actually, he is. Well, that spacing was almost immaculate. But Kai, Kai is yeah. just kind of shitting around. You would down smash that. Ooh, grab that. My beer may be too cold. <laughs> or, you know? Yeah. Oh my office. god, that SDI. Just the pressure is now different. There's a lot more confidence. Oh my god, okay! Oh, you're there. Oh, spot dunks me there. Oh, Jordy's such a chad, dude. These dash attacks are probably like the only really big issue. The mo Jordy! Jordy. Oh no, Fest is sad. Don't even look at him and say Jordy. Wait, Jordy's owning. I thought Jody was losing, that's funny. No, he's actually pumping him. Kai's really? pressure is just like, kinda not doing well. Jody, so, he like, sl like you said before, slowed down gamer. But with an idea. I think, uh, you know, it's hard to run a tournament and play. <laughs> Jody just kind of rolls in here, practices all day. Jody, but probably listening to Primit on a go right now. All he ever wanted really was the world. And Johnny didn't come climbing yesterday, so his forearms are in pristine shape. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I think, yeah, this is when the nerves come in. This amazing player just like slowing down. There's less lasers, too. Like, you have control here, you know? Exactly. Dude, McLeod really liked climbing. He said it was probably the highlight of his weekend, even if he comes like third in the tournament. Oh, that's cute. I know. Wow. Chad! Pretty good save from a pretty bad position to put himself in. Oh, no, that's fine though. The thing is, Jordy's only really killed himself if he's taken bad. That's true. These wall jumps are owning Kai right now. Yeah, Kai doesn't really have an answer there. You'd think Kai, like, as as a recovery specialist and someone who has all these mix-ups himself would know the, uh... This is bad. Kai drops that though. That's everything. Uh, and Kai fun. takes that. Kai is still in this, and he's looking strong. Jordy's kind of doubting himself now. Yeah. He's thinking, should I go to the Ganon? Should I even play this character? Leave <laughs> oh. Jordy alone. Well, actually, Jordy had the flu last year as well, so... Fuck, oh, man. Don't forget the flu tag. Not to let everyone know they have the flu. Yeah. Weak bear? Down smash. Oh, it's, it's, it's flubs. <laughs> Maybe Jordy is just not sick enough this year. Oh, Ooh, that's yeah, that was bad. Oh, that's a choke. That's Genesis. Just leave the ledge alone if you choke like this, man. That's it, yeah. Yeah, Jordy yeah. takes a good one. Kai giving a, a uh, unimpressed look. A Sora fan in the crowd, making excited motions at Sora. And Sora reciprocating. Always a fan of engagement with the people. I didn't so sign up for this, Nick, man. I'm just trying to enjoy my cool crisp beer. Dark Sided Sora. Follow Dark Sided on Twitter. <laughs> a great organization. <sighs> great boys. Man, most of the great fighting game players in Australia are on that organization, to be honest. Honestly? All of the most deserving and best. What are you trying to fucking say, Nick, huh? Huh? I'm saying you're the king. It's not <laughs> <laughs> Uh, fuck off, man. <laughs> I stayed on comms to just cop this bullshit. Yeah, I just hate being complimented. Okay. And Kai, starting out strong on Battlefield, his home ground. Where he grew up. Kai was forged in the field of battle. Oh my! Nice life. Oh, it's actually so dumb. Kai literally just made snake like motion and it kind of scared me. Yeah, I don't like when Kai makes uh, positive mentality pages. Yeah, like smiling in the face of SD. It's just like, let let the hate flow through you sometimes, you know? Just nod it off or something. Don't, like, smile at it. It's like, well, Beth. Well, that's a double laser. Oh, Kai is actually shitting the bed right now. He has, like, a strong start to this game, and, uh... You're not fucking with me. You can't be fucking up. And he be fucking up. I'd be choking hard. <laughs> I would like to see a side be there. Oh. Don't... Oh, what the fuck? Actually... So what happened? The world's smartest laser from Kai. Baits him into something. How did that miss? It was a terrible laser to shoot. Because, like, he had a free yeah. What is going on? Australian melee. It's great. Fun. Well, we're trying. <laughs> Grab ledge, yes. 
and Kai with a mountain to climb. Hope you brought his ice picks, baby. We're in for a fucking bumpy ride. Right? Brought his bloody chalk. It's truth. <laughs> I love saying bloody. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I need it down there. there. Kai is just gonna camp on the platforms, I think. I think that's gonna be a strategy. So smart. <laughs> so smart. Jordan doesn't really turn it up when he's ahead, though. Doesn't have the killer instinct. These shine grabs are owning Kai. But only for like 10% of the time, you know? You, once you get that oh, big, o big opening, you gotta really finish him off. <laughs> Miles yelling Jordy in the crowd. Wow, that down air had no place hitting. And Kai doesn't get a shine out of the shield there. You gotta hit the Jordy, to that you gotta... This has been his problem for a while, but it's such a hard problem to fix, just like not being able to close it out. Yeah, great. Great, good stuff. No, that was really good. I'm really proud of Jordy for closing that game from uh, Jorgos. <laughs> Jorgi. Kaiser, Kaiser I am uh, getting the fuck. Yeah, let me out of this. Uh... Twitch.tv slash KP Kaiser. Tell your friends. Tell your friends. This is Dark Side of Sora. Tell your Signing mom. off. Tell your dad. Tell your mom. Tell SA Nick. Tell everyone, SA I want Nick. everyone to tell tweet at SA Nick right now saying, we love you, Nick. Okay? Please. He needs it. He's having a really, bit of a rough day. You can see right now. I kiss I'm you. trying to get through oh, everything. I'm supposed uh, to show the actual kiss. Oh. Don't do it, man. No. Don't do you know, it. Um, my wisdom teeth are coming in, right? Before we go, and it's making the gap between my teeth bigger. How fucked is that? Look at that. Look at it. It's fucked. Yelling into the void right now. Um. Thank you so much. Uh, Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Woo. Have a nice rest of the stream, team. I'm Let off. Of Sora's off. Thank it's you. been SA Nick. It's Thank been Sora. All. Let me have the last word, please. Uh, follow me on Twitter. Follow Darksiders on Twitter. Look, a great org. <laughs> Goodbye. Please, please. If we get three followers, I'll let you eat for the week. Bye. All right, everyone, thanks for watching wave one of pools at Big G's 2 for Melee. We're going to be getting wave two started later in the day. Feel free to check out the other streams from this event. You got Couch Warriors Smash upstairs streaming Ultimate, and you also have Couch Warriors streaming the FTC. So check out the event on Twitch. And you can follow me at KP Kaza on Twitter and follow Couch Warriors SA on Twitter for all the updates from the event. We're going to have some small downtime here on the stream while there's no melee to be played, but stick around, everyone.